Hello, we are back once more with a bit of Honkai Star Rail. Um, mainly due to me still having to catch up with some of the events, like this Winyard in Cups event is like on for like a few weeks already. <laughs> The Cosmo Odyssey I've already completed. We also got this Tides of War event, which recently got out due to like Eventurine also coming out. So yeah. Um Which is also actually a thing I wanna do. Both for Eventurine. <laughs> um and let's see how uh, lucky we get on getting her. Sadly, no Gallagher in there anymore, so I'm currently missing Gallagher. <laughs> because I, I didn't even try to, like, like want to try to roll for him. Mm. I just want to see what this actually has for an effect. Eclipse, da 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 So yeah, let's do some adventure rewards first. Okay. Okay! I lost a 50-50, but I finally get Himeko, which I've been missing. I've been missing Himiko for so long. So I'm not even mad for losing the 50-50. Mm. I'm getting a lot of like... Uh, Copies. Hmm. And if the last time before we get Aventurine. Sweet. <laughs> Funny thing is, now we're only missing Gallagher when it comes to characters. Because now we've got Timiko. Actually, I can get Gallagher from one of the events, so that's why I didn't even vote for him. That's sweet. Also, uh, my current leveling pro uh, progress, I have finished up my Acheron. Um, also of choices, 10 on everything, so I've fully maxed it so far. I've also got a 20 build up. I think the only thing I'm missing for, for him is a bit more levels on one of the relics. Um, since I've been missing like a proper physical DPS. Besides Clara, which is more like a sub DPS. Um, but yeah, since I'm like still like missing a proper wind DPS, I'm currently building up late. And am I only like missing like five or five stars to actually level up fully? <laughs> I'm sure if I also will go for like a four star in between, maybe in case they give me something I might need, but so far. Hmm. Nice, let's go. Okay. 
I can't even give them like a few my level ups now because I'm like mm, <laughs> used all my current level up materials on Blade. So yeah. But hey, at least I also got finally Himiko. And I definitely want to build her. Because besides Toppers, I also don't really have like a proper fire DPS. I mean, yeah, I even this whole dot party, but I could build up hook. Okay, yeah, that. Next up, I will say we go for the winning in caps, and yeah, here's the. Uh, character selection so I can get Gallagher <laughs> without any issues and I think this will also be the first event we will go for Actually, with my with this party actor, so. Hmm. I'm actually not sure why they have Kafka in this party. To be honest, this should be a follow-up party, not a weird mix-up party. I mean, Kafka has a bit of follow-up, but. Uh. I'll just put him in my Hey there! Didn't we already meet before? You should listen up a bit. The place is quiet, but that's okay. We can talk whatever we want here. Did your conversation with Gallagher last time go well? He might look like he doesn't care about anything, but he actually has a lot on his mind. Otherwise, he wouldn't be a regular here. My place offers nothing but joy. This asked me just to tell me that. <laughs> what do you want to talk about then? Chatting is just a way to get closer to each other. As long as the conversation fulfills its purpose, it doesn't matter that we actually what we actually talk about. Don't you think so? Alright, we see more wrecks now. I went here because I needed your help. Are you interested in, in the art of mixing drinks, especially after seeing how well Gallagher does it? Sometimes unexpect uh, something unexpected has come up and I need to be away for a while. I'm looking for someone to take my place temporarily. I think you've got a talent to ace the trip. What do you say? I've picked the, pick the right person. I've always had a good eye for talent and I believe you'll be an awesome drinksmith. Come on and try it. Don't be nervous, I'll guide you step by step. Okay. But this actually be uh, um, somewhat similar to like, the ongoing mixing event. Um, I'll follow the first step. Select a mini wine class. Uh, classes have different royals and that determines the number of concrete portions that can fit inside, obviously. Let's continue the next mixing step. I'm for the step in a large amount of ice. Um, each drink has three flavors, sweetness, intensity and thickness. Okay. I said, uh, what, let's follow the steps and add a portion of practitioner's pepper first. Can these drinks have changed? Yep, of course. This is also the flavor tag resulting from the changed sweetness. 
Mm, I saw that. Stirring or mixing ingredients in a glass together, which can change the drink's appearance. Drink. Not gonna lie, at least the colors look nicer before mixing. Hmm, <laughs> the origami bird, sure. It looks good. Okay, if you wanna say Clement Dreamscape, it does look appropriate. You're getting the hand of things already. Technique-wise, you're a pass. Just to be clear, flattery will get you nowhere. It doesn't make my mood better, though. Uh, it does make my mood better, though. Knowing the mixing technique is the prerequisite to becoming a drinksmith. However, it takes more than that to serve drinks that impress your guests. The most crucial skill as a good drinksmith needs is listening. Drinksmithing is all about having conversations with your guests. Drinks are magical, a beautiful glass of liquid, a cozy ambience, and a little bit of conversational skill are all you need to make someone open up. This might sound a bit esoteric, but I believe you have the knack for it. I can tell you as someone with empathy. Not only that, but you can also read someone's mind and even regulate their emotions. Ah. I never found about my power. I've learned to pick up things from my experience here. Being able to understand guests is a must for every drinksmith. I saw you having a good time talking to Emeki last time. I know her well. She can be clingy, and it's not easy to convince her to leave without making a fuss, so I believe you're the right fit for the job. What do you say? I'll take your silence as a yes. I'll stay silent then. <laughs> You've got a great sense of humor. You already cut out for this. Before start, I need to give you a heads up. The name of this place is Dream Troid Hostelry, and there's something unique about it. At this lounge, we don't serve the guests or dream chasers in Panacone, but the monsters staying in the hotel in the dreamscape. Okay. They used to be the members of the Sweet Dreams troop that serve the family, as you should know. The dreamscape is collapsing. The negative emotions have altered the temperament of the troop members, turning them into uncontrollable monsters. I stay here to help them stabilize their emotions and restore them to the original form, which can be a long process. If the issue isn't resolved, they will revert to the frenzied state, which is the last thing I want to see. Please take care of the monsters when I'm not around. <laughs> I'm member of the Friends Protection Society, yeah, nah. So there's a catch. Since the job scope is more or less the same, it doesn't count as fraud, does it? Well. Those monsters aren't aggressive, so they won't hurt you. It's just that the personalities can be a little abrasive, so you need to be more patient. You can find details about a condition in this troubleshooter. Feel free to flip through it and jot down stuff in it. Oh, okay. These are the customers we need to serve. Yes, they are members of the Dream Shot group. Mm, their respective emotional troubles are recorded here. Hysterical, Woody Jumby, Bringster. I mean, it does look like a Bringster. I uh, can't have a monomus for someone. Alright. You need to chat and make drinks for the monsters and gain their trust that way. After gaining their complete trust, you'll be able to obtain an item to access the inner world. Uh, the introductions are basically done. Let us continue our earlier conversation. Making drinks for the monsters to gain the trust and help with the emotional troubles is the job of a tree drink smith at a Dream Shot Hostelry. It does sound like I'm a counselor. Aha, you can put it that way. The chance to have in depth conversation with monsters doesn't come by every day. Consider it a pearl. Actually, your job is pretty much the same to listen to the needs of the monsters and provide suitable drinks to them. Try talking to them as much as possible. They really hate to be lonely. Still remember what I just said now. 
Uh, what is it just now? Drink your magical things that can make someone open up. What a drinksmith can achieve is so much more than you might expect. Now I'll leave the dream draw hostelry under your care. Alright. Mmm, can't use different customers. I think I will switch to the mouse and keyboard for this. <sighs> I can't do tutorials, thank you, game. My uh, mission is to resolve the monsters. Emotional troubles. You'll be able to see your progress here. Bring yourself your customers to earn tips. Okay. The tips you can earn will exchange, don't forget. I think I was already quickly enough you know, for starting. The ingredients are all in the lounge. The whole range. Feel free to use them. I will charge you. Oh, I almost forgot. I will pay you based on your workload if the customers are happy. The pay will satisf satisfy you for sure. I'll be watching things from over there. Take it easy and dive into your work. Uh, let's take a look at this new drinksmith. Let me guess, you owe Shio Bans some money, which is how you got roped into working here. That must be it, I knew it. Shio Ban looks soft spoken and treats people so gentle. She's a qui quite a talker. Whenever she's on the street, people always ask if she wants to become a celebrity. But she's definitely a devil in disguise. You started with me, how much do you owe her? Let's see. How can I help you with that? Hmm. No do that for me? Are you kidding me? You don't really think I was going to help you pay off your debt. I was saying, I know a place where you can struggle rich. In the back of the hotel in the dreamscape, there's a monster that looks like an alarm clock and enjoys having people tell it off. So you could go over, spit a few sentences at it, maybe that will put it in a good mood, and then it will give you all its money. Remember, you can't uh, say that it was the one who told you. <laughs> Okay, now, we go to Smith and put in an order for me. Let's get a bit of ones, let me think. I think I want that uh, Lost Twilight. I'm even seeing this drink on my menu. Okay, let's start preparing that. Mmm, customers orders are here. Okay. Mmm, need a large rank for this. Okay. Oh wait, it's two times soda. I didn't see that. Very bitter wood, very mellow. Okay. Mm, the Robin card. Ah. This looks soothing. I look, I'm, I'll sleep now. The bitter tones we've created are so unique. <laughs> okay. Whoa, 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 the color of the drink suits me so well. Look at how deep and profound I am. So deep that I'm flying. What was I saying? Oh, the hotel in the dreamscape is not safe. Shiuban doesn't let us go too far, but just between us, I saw lots of people over there a few days ago. They were all wearing something like black suits. Uh, black suits. They wanted to arrest me when they saw me. I was so shocked I got teary eyed. In the end, guess what? They don't even dare to. Step foot in here. <laughs> I stood inside uh, and started really mocking them. They were so mad that smoke was coming out of their ears. All they could do was walk away with the tails between their legs. Pretty interesting, right? Sounds like it would, uh, was the platforms, no? How about I did firstly? Bring me another super intense drink. One that reminds me of the choice of playing tricks on them. Super intense. Mm, they just mentioned the flavor that they want to try. So, green strings. Okay. Mm, 
both seem to be very strong. Let's go with this one. Uh, so was ice spin touch. Okay. Less ice. It's still three ice cubes, but okay. Lucky card, there you go. Looks like it was the right one. Did you get a job? Uh, good job. Doing it is, it's like I can feel the bit of emotions of those people in black suits. It's like, stop going home crying to your mother. <laughs> With all that said, I feel way more comfortable. I guess even a bad Twinksmith is still a Twinksmith who can spare you a word or two. I think I've had enough. I'm off. Take care of yourself, newbie. Don't let Shiuban eat your life. I feel like the way there is a bit crazy, but it seemed to be pretty easy to get along with. We got a commission for spade. Hmm. Already 50%. Okay. Mm. Okay. Oh, hello, new to Smith. I'm Zoda Dog. Just the side of me will bring people joy. You look pretty tired. Is there anything I can help you with? I couldn't even check like his character sheet playing. Oh, if not, I need to thank me, even if I agree to help, I won't live for Paul to help. And that's because I'm a dog. I can't do anything. You shouldn't have high, ex uh, high uh, shouldn't have had high expectations of me in the first place, Wolf. So try to write me up on purpose. You're getting angry, aren't you? You're getting angry, angry. Oof, but you're the drink smith of all this lounge, so even if you're mad, you still gotta make me a drink, isn't that right? You're too kind, thank you. Listen up, I want a refreshing drink, please, woof. Boo, it please, woof. Is there any option to toss this dog out? Hmm. This is actually the drink smith simulator. Uh. Oh, it one's very refreshing. Okay, you even get like this hint, this will not match the demands, even if it's that refreshing. Weird. Yeah, have here, you've got this to look beautiful, just like yours truly. Okay. I love this ring move. No, you're the top of the pack when it comes to serving customers. I still have a question. With so many fun places out there, why don't you come here to be a drink smith? We are passionate about drinking makes. Just listen to yourself. Do you even believe in what you just said? It's not good to lie. This isn't your lounge. Spending your time and energy to satisfy other people's demands. He, you're working a job. If just here working a job, you shouldn't use the title of Trinksmith. A fancy title isn't going to cover your essence. Oh, you didn't have to. You have emotional problems. Emotionally stable. So emotionally stable that you'd be annoyed. Is there a problem with that? What about yourself? As the Trinksmith making harsh comments about the customers, it's really inappropriate. Are you good one crossing line here? Am I? I mean, maybe. Let's make it here. Where we use the rules to attack the other persons will be declared a dog. That's her, right? That should be no problem. There's nothing much to say. Better just continue, uh, continue drinking. I want a slightly sweet drink. Can you do it? That one's slightly sweet. That's 
Plus the lighter is sweet. Vitamin syrup. Okay, there you go. There is a string. Uh, flavor I like. You really know how to, to make me happy. I'm feeling a bit dizzy. It's not nice. Uh, it's so nice talking to you. Come hang out with you some other day. Be sure to welcome you with open arms. I'm the solar dog that brings happiness to everyone. Goodbye. This dog is really infuriating. Emotional troubles. Trash talk. Oh, likes to mock other people. Skill of being alone. Okay. It seems to also but likes to provoke. Pessimistic, depressed, running in memories, looking confident in lacking confidence in motivation. Gets angry all the time. It can also the PC and everything narcissistic full of themselves. The most annoying type. We. Ray can't talk about it, he sure hides the true thoughts, likes to flirt, but easily gets embarrassed. This person is excessively worried, doesn't trust anyone. Also get Rosa, but keeps hurrying on the, the periphery. Okay. I bought a blue fuse already just after serving two customers. Is everything all going right? Uh, I feel like teaching them a lesson, I guess. As someone to feel that way in the beginning, please don't take it to heart. They are just too affected by the nightmare that they can be a bit twisted. When things were good in the past, they were a bunch of lovely and sensible kids. I really appreciate your hard work. I only lend uh, in the near to them. And we respond to the issues well. I'm morally grateful because we can accept these monsters and treat them as equals. Hmm, it's time to give you the advanced lesson. A creative mind is key to mixing drinks. You need to come up with special blends based on the time and your customer's preference. After showing the ropes about free mixing, you'll be able to craft drinks that aren't on the menu. This is something every drinksmith has to learn. Things could go boring if you keep dishing out the same recipes. For instance, I want a large extra sweet drink and bring back happy memories of my past. Nothing on the menu for Sucram. What should you do now? Mm, don't panic. me, let me show you what to do. Most of the time customers have customized requests for drinks. The customer has Request a specific class size, pick one of the large classes this time. You can fill the request, okay. The step where the customer doesn't make a request will be your time to shine. Let's give a bit of ice. The request is extra sweet. Let us review the rules of mixing drinks. Okay, okay, okay. I don't need to do so right.
Trail Racer Special. Excellent! Your quest for flavors is on point, that you can accurately perceive what's on someone's mind. I might ask you to make a drink for me one day. I'll be gone for a while, but the monsters will st uh, be stirred for by from time to time. Please tend the lounge for me. Without the drinks here, I'm worried these monsters might get antsy. Now you must be trained after long shift. Take a break. Dealing with those beers, day in, day out is indeed quite tiring. We can drink so it's certainly no easy feat. Oh yeah, I can imagine like it's pretty also like working as a bartender and stuff like that. I could imagine it being quite tiring if you have especially to deal with a certain type of people. Let's make sure she runs not around. Let's open for business. No. Also, like, I've recently done this uh, spontaneous drunk stream because I've, like, um, had a friend own. We've been, like, mixing drinks ourselves. And I also created my own little drink, which is like quite uh, specifically catered to my taste. Doro, I need to improve the ratios a bit still. But it was pretty tasty, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, tell me about how to reduce the recipes for the specific drinks. Uh, recipe deduction, okay. Alright, after we saw uh. For the drink selected, she's in the hatcher. Okay, I feel like this is like unstirred. Same girl with an origami bird. Oh yeah. I think that was that, and that's dirt. With a bit of extra soak lead and souping soda. That's it. Okay. I guessed right. Our only statistics. to unlock eventually. Alright. Oh, whatever. I told you to make a super thick drink in a small class. You hear me? 
What are you looking at? I don't care who you think you are, as long as you are behind the debilitated launch and theft those dirty glasses next to you, then you better listen to me and do what I want. I am the one paying you, got it? You'll catch more drift and hurry up and start mixing your drinks. Stop pretending like you're doing something. I don't need any rumors of that idiot. You guys might like this really get my blood boiling. Stop preparing a drink. I already learned remixing. Because my first can fulfill certain requests. By this time, let's start using this remixing. Okay. Uh, super thick drink in a small glass. There you go. Uh, that's what I want. Anyone uh, smart enough to uh, listen basic also make a little bit of a bit of scratch at the very least. You're coming from Shioban. Can a fool like you come up with any interesting tricks? What a joke. I'm not kidding when I say I've been a patron of this lawn since it started. Back then there weren't even proper tables. The counter was just thrown together and would fall apart if you put any weight on it. This place didn't even have the full range of ingredients. Even considering how awful the drinks were back then, the drinks you made was just the worst. What killed me even more was... If I've taught you how I was wrecked of this launch, you still didn't show me respect. Besides how a server should act, huh? Listen here, you and you, so you better act like it. Be sure to bow, do your job right and serve your customers. Be the humblest you can be. I'm here to buy happiness, so you should be making me feel special, got it? It's pointless to tell you. Just give me a small class. I want it sweet with clearly colored layers. I've got a great eye that's allergic to things that like aesthetic. Okay, I didn't do uh, do it sweet. And hey, mayonnaise. No, all right. Don't worry about it. And also, uh, if you have a concert, good luck with that. <laughs> I'm doing fine, and you? That's some strange aesthetic regarding layers. Uh, okay. Small grass, sweet, multicolored, distinctive, okay. See you. I mean, I got two color layers. Oh, does it have like specifically two layers of colors? Yeah, it does have to be specifically two layers. 
Interesting. Hmm. Here's our little baby cake. Just witness is just right. I quite enjoyed it. We got a decent talent. A decent taste. I made my demands clear and I can make some palatable stuff for you. That's all. A random place with an awful drink smith and dump monsters. <laughs> Are you all hiding in your playing house? Well, what's the matter? Got something to say? There's a chance. Put it out. Jeez, is that how you treat a customer? You stay right there. I'm going to wake you into a scrap metal. Just to wait. I've got a lot of days ahead of us. Don't assume that Shiva Bank can protect you. Just to wait. Quite rude and arrogant monster. It is quite big though. As soon as I can get like an affordable trade, I think I can get put into the uh, 72. If I can get max 24 out of each of them, then it's, it's actually pretty good. Shake, shake. The dice were. Uh, uh, the dice were off. Wait, the dice were as fate plays its tune. I just <laughs> coincidentally have some dice laying around on my desk. Don't have actually uh, playing DD quite a few times. Dang it, you again. How much money do you owe? Did you sign a contract or rather uh, of guarantee that you're gonna work this launch until it's back to its former glory? Listen near you, just forget about it. Why not uh, enjoy this time? Let's play dice. Come on, test your luck. Let's get started. Are you going big or small? Big or small? The dealer calls the shots and all bets are in. Lose and you've got to pay. Win and you don't. Go back. I'm sure you want to choose big. Big, big, big. Oh no. Did I think of it? I bet it's gonna be big. Because all the small numbers have been scratched off by me. They were not comf uh, comfortable to sit on. Why is making me want to rush to the bathroom? So you're gonna going big? Not gonna change? Speak now or forever hold your blaze. Go on big or go home. Yeah, I'm on the edge of my seat. Is it small or is it small? Adidas starts with a tap dance for you and the dice sports faster and faster, keeping in, in time with the performance. Just as the body catches the rhythm and starts to sway, the dance ends abruptly. You can see plain as day that each side of the die has a single dot. It's small, small, just as I expected. That's my fault. I put in too much uh, force when digging into the dice. Looks like I made a pit instead. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry to say that you lost. But that's okay. I'm bored now. I'm feeling super burnout. out. Give me a drink, quick. I want uh, the drink that's in a small glass and has a strong taste. A taste that rejuvenates my spirit instantly. Players may remember to replenish your electrolytes after exercise. You can fill in the drink menu. <laughs> Smart rest with an intense, intense taste. Do a bit of ice. Mm 
Why does this look stirred? Oh, it can be very strong. Mm. Okay, we just like once we yeah, one thing's uh, strong. Then let's do it like this. Oh, there's of the stupid alarm clock, buttons up, all of us invigorating and lighting tears. So, woohoo! I'm feeling so good and I'm flying. I want to feel less happy every day. Speaking of which, I just thought of something very sad again. I once was a kid, you know? The kind who literally could have gone small if he said he was going to go big. That was true up until... until I was signed to work at a hotel. The environment here is just the worst. The air is so stuffy and they won't even let me go to the bathroom when I want. They're suffocating me. I mean emotionally suffocating. Those people in black suits are always watching. They never give me time to rest. Before long, I found myself forgetting if I should toss big or small. To be honest, it's not really that important. Doesn't matter or not. Clearly the guests are the ones playing, and yet you want me to cheat? Give me another drink. This time I want a large glass, bitter and super strong. Small or large, I drink them all. They are all the same, no problem. That's what should I choose. Mm. Let's go. Hmm. Like this, uh, I do it like this for you. Wait, it's at large, not super sized. Flawless, other than anything to class. Looks really nice. Ah, the deeper the goblet, the truer the friendship. I love that you can understand me. I'm off. I remember you in your week, Smith. I feel so, so good, I want to sing. If we stick together, you won't need to worry about the bad guys. I just pack up and leave if the family is too powerful. 
There's no need to back over. We better to be hungry than angry. I just had a bunch of spades for so I guess you must trust me more now. Okay, you got a cock also now. Ah, oh, the soda dog goes back, of course. The soda dog brings happiness, uh, that brings happiness has returned to wizard you. Very looking forward to seeing me. Are you happy? Thank you, but no matter how much you look forward to it, it's pointless. I don't care what you think in the slightest. I go wherever, please, and say whatever I want. There's nothing anyone can do about me. I used to be like you, busily serving drinks to customers. If anyone said something to me, I just respond with Roger. Oof. But one day, I had this epiphany. A dog life is also a life. Rather than let people shave off time from my life, I will shave it off theirs. If you don't do anything, no one will notice you. All that matters is that you are happy. You finally get it, but getting it is only the beginning. What's most important is that you take action. I see you're pretty tired. Why not start practicing with me? Make a large and strong drink, and I'll teach you how to interact with people. How are you not getting a beat down? Oh, makes an impressive sense of comfort. I feel like doing the normal recipes is like stupid anyway. <laughs> it just say uh, it just always pushing you to do the free mixing anyway. As we always have nothing to worry about, never getting up tricks. It's uh, it's doing not enough. Okay. The flavor is amazing. From now on, you're the best drink smith in my heart. After drinking this, it's time to teach you how to talk. <laughs> Listen up. Hey, idiot dog. You really want to teach someone with the pathetic brain of yours? Yubi, don't let this dog appear and stoop you. The dog looks cute, but in reality, everything it has to say is unpleasant. When a dog was a courier, it got the highest number of negative reviews. Making fun of customers, stealing soda, and pocketing tips. It's never done what it's supposed to, beyond wagging the tail of its tail heavily. I forgot that out. God, I may be crazy, but I've never heard anybody. I've known the dog for a long time. I've never heard anything good about it. Let me tell you, it's a selfish pet moth dog. It's best if you keep a distance. Don't give yourself unnecessary headaches. Headaches. Mr. Dean is often pulling things out of in here and causing trouble wherever he goes. He's kind of, you know, oh wait, why is the model playing? Kind of, you know, no one at a lounge likes him. Hey, who are you talking about? I heard everything you just said. If you're going to talk smack about me behind my back, I have to give you a hard time. I'm having a private conversation with our dear Drinksmith here. Mind your business. Everything Mr. Dealer says is a lie, so don't mind him. He's not like me. I will always wag my tail in a friendly way to you. That's the only thing I can do. You think I believe you? I don't care if you don't believe me. I'm just saying whatever I want. Tell hit me with another. I want something sweet, refreshing. Something along those lines. 
Well, these two don't have a good relationship. There you go. This tastes amazing. The Shibuya once not around here. Uh, the greatest swingsmith here. I really turn my mood around, but I wonder if I drank too much. I'm seeing lots of black spots. <laughs> oh here! Oh here! Good little doggy, let's play. Come with me, I'll take you to a fun place. You want to play with me? Wait for me! Spade took Mr. Big Week out to play. I wonder if those two will cause trouble. But I feel like I understand Mr. Big Week more now listen if they sing to it. I guess. Hmm why is there a commotion? Was they made a mess? I love this radio. You broke it. I want you to pay for it. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to break it. I just had it too tightly and crushed it by accident. <laughs> I'm going to cry. More bodies. What happened? I led my radio to the dealer out of kindness, but he smashed it on the ground. There was no smashing of any kind. To be more precise, I only pinched it, and it shattered after I applied a little pressure. How fragile. Oh, wow. Did you hear him? It shouldn't have happened if the radio was harder than the floor, would it? You're clearly messing with it. I will tear into pieces. I'm doing something like a call shots here. I'm being framed, newcomer. You've got to help me out. I didn't do anything. It was all his fault. You wouldn't admit to any wrongdoings. I should probably ask him separately. I will do The radio just randomly started blaring out a loud noise. I started and slipped. My grasp on the radio loosened and then it dropped. I'm a victim too. Besides, it's just a radio. What's the big deal anyway? If he wants to listen to something, I will give him something to listen to. I can talk about all kinds of stuff. Scary, funny, serious or even the kind of stuff you can't put on the airwaves. Well now, I'm also quite an expert when it comes to canon jokes. Apologize. Are you serious? You want me, an innocent, passionate kid, to bow my head and apologize to the idiot pooch? I feel so wronged. Of course, I know what I have done. I can't tell the difference between right and wrong. To be honest with you, I did it on purpose. Bring it on. Show me wha what's what. I've been like this since the day I was born. Nobody can deal with me. Maybe I can seize this chance to slip into his internal world and help him change his bad habit of pranking others. Teach him a lesson. I put it into the emo, uh, Spade's emo scape. Already a TikTok. Sure, let's go. Oh, I think you hate me or not be able to do anything about it. It says to catch him, but would it actually make it harder or easy to catch him? I see. He's gonna make it hard. Um, oh, there it is. I'm guessing he's up there.
And he ran again. Let me get on, I will know as well as wrong. I'm truly sorry and I will apologize to every dog around the world who has been, ever been bullied. From this moment on, I will be the protector of all dogs. I will make sure no dog ever cries and will do so until the day I die. I, I Let me teach you another Levinson. Uh, actually, I didn't really do it on purpose. That wasn't at all. It's just that uh, Chiobahn hasn't been around recently. I thought maybe if I made a scene, she might come back. Shearban would come rushing back if uh, the monster were in trouble. I'm sure of it. So that's why I smashed that idiot, idiot poot thing. Hmm. Should have done it, right? I know. I uh, don't know. From here on out, I'll be sure to not bother or make fun of that idiot poot. Idiot poot. See how hard that slap was? It hurt so much. I'll never forget. What if you let me off this time? I'm only taking chances. Oh, wow, I've been rigorously revived. I'm a good boy. I'm putting my uninhibited nature behind. It's all happy days from here. Everyone likes dice. <laughs> nah, I don't feel like if his emotional troubles already probably resolved, but... I guess we have to see. It's not my fault. All I did was let him derate you out of kindness of my heart, and the next thing I knew, you smashed it. You didn't even swing a spliff. You've got to help me. You've got to help me. You didn't actually do anything wrong? I didn't. I did taunt the dealer a little. I laughed a little loudly and said he didn't have a family. But it doesn't mean he can go and smash my treasure. It was so important to me, and and the radio represented an important memory for me. Shiban gave it to me. Shiban hasn't been around recently. There's no one for me to play with. I'm so lonely. That's the only reason I wanted to play with the dealer. I made him angry on purpose because I wanted him to notice me. If I didn't do that, no one would pay attention to me. At the very least. If I behave badly, more selfish, I can be happy. At least you will talk to me more. Maybe it becomes unbearable because of uh, no one spending time with him. I should go into this internal world and see what's going on. Well, even though he's like actually feeling rather lonely and just is wanting to get attention. The way he's going about this is definitely not. Uh, yeah. It's not a good way to go about it, just to say it like that. Just about shooting me all over the place, I guess. I 
I feel so much better. Who knew having some company could be such a wonderful thing? You gotta take me out to play again. I wanna go play, I wanna go play. If I were just a Zoda dog that brings you happiness, who's smart and nice, I will be friendly and won't cause any trouble. Play with me again sometime, Jinksmith. Okay, then he's done. Hmm. I don't know if you tweaks are out okay. there. Hey, did pooch, it did pooch, it did, it did, it did, it did pooch. I've got uh, quite a mouth, no one can handle this. You still haven't paid me back for the radio you broke. Even if this launch is big, you won't escape. Uh, well, how about this? I will take you to the hotel room. There's all sorts of stuff in there that guests don't want. I'm sure you feel something you will like. Got a radio that works. You find out if you go take a look. I'm off. Better keep up, or you'll be eating my dust. Wait for me! Looks like they've patched things up. It doesn't really look like it, to be honest. Hey, I'm back. How did it go? Did you like being a drinksmith while I was away? Mm. Oh, we're gonna come with us at moments. You look pretty cute when you're sad. What problem with you encounter? I'm all ears. Sharing is so important. We can double our blessings and cut our burdens in half. The work of a drinksmith is all about listening and chatting. Especially about what happened. So that's what happened. As the collapse of the dreamscape accelerates, the monster's emotion become increasingly unstable. Similar conflicts will only keep growing in number. Who knows, maybe we'll have a bigger headache to deal with later. But you did great. You're a bonafide drinksmith. Allow me to thank you on their behalf. This is part of a drinksmith gig, huh? As a drinksmith, a uh, dream job hustery, handling the monster's interpersonal relationships is all part of the job. Didn't I tell you right when you started? Being a drinksmith here isn't a walk in the park. In the park. You do something for me? Please make me a drink. We've been a drinksmith for so long that we've already figured it out. If a customer is um, sitting around from you, across from you, that means they've absolutely trust you. You can't come at this job with a 9-5 mentality. I can't wait to see what kind of drink you make me. This place is called Dream Drought Hostelry because all the guests here are members of the Dream Drought Group. You've seen the Sweet Dream Troop, right? The spirit boards that run around the streets, the music instruments that play automatically, and those surprisingly large eyes in the dreamscape. Objects with self awareness, like that, are everywhere. All those monsters used to be part of the Sweet Dream Troop. Hardworking, well trained, and obedient to the family. Providing amusement and services to the guests. Yeah, they were all good children. Until the nightmare struck and turned them into monsters. The form did you now see insane and babbling. What's your solution to this? A solution is what you're doing now, making the right things, so listening to our guests' thoughts and calming them down. Before bec uh, becoming a drinksmith, I used to be administrator of the Sweet Dreams troop. My title might have been the administrator, but I treated them like my own family. That's why it hurts me to see them in this state. So I decided to stay here. Only that I could help them get a bit normal again. They can regain recognition from the people and have happy lives. But the process was too long. Even with the monster's emotional issues temporarily blockaded, the nightmares will still return time and time again with no end in sight. And I'm starting to feel tired. Is this why you asked me for help? Well, I'm getting a bit sleepy. That's all for now. I'll tell you more later when your chance arises. I have enough atmosphere to generate inspiration now. Please make me a drink that brings feeling of nostalgia in an extra large glass. It is slightly sweet. The taste should be particularly strong. Yeah. Mm, flavor based nostalgic. Slightly bit la mellow stir. Customers will sometimes have requests for the beverage flavor base. 
To create a flavor base, first prepare the required normal flavor, then give it some stirring. Which is an extra large class. Get to proceed. Mm. It should be strong. No eyes. Okay. Raise it down and it's slightly sweet. Oh, Papa Gold Milk is new. As created from stirring, won't be influenced by subsequent added ingredients. I will leave the rest to you. Okay, very strong. That should be it. It is great. Besides Gallagher, you are the fastest learner I've ever met when it comes to mixing drinks. Are we not planning on working at this lounge for a long time? Drinks never that taste great or terrible reflect your most genuine force at this moment. How you understand the guests before you and how we intend to respond to their trust. This might seem simple, but there's so much more than that. Oh, there's something else I need to tell you. Even though the family treats the sweet room troops as mere props for the guest entertainment, there are quite a few people who take a genuine interest in them. Some have even told me about them become regulars at the lounge. If interested, you can also invite your trusted friends here. Are you going to tell others about the monsters? To be honest, this is a bit risky, as the family always intends to wipe out the monsters. However, I have faith in your judgment. That's all for now. You must be tired too. Get some rest. The road ahead is long and it will be tougher than you expect. I'm going to leave you between you and the two of them. We'll probably get along peacefully at the launch now, right? Shuban was once the administrator of the Sweet Dream Troop. How unexpected. No wonder she has such a soft spot for monsters. Okay. Morazas were into monsters coming and the launch shifts up. Shiban hasn't shown up yet. Well, let's start serving customers anyway. Let's do some more deductions first. Easy. Let's be real, okay. Yep, that's the problem. Winter Regard. Okay. Yeah. 
Is he very strong and very thick? Really nice. Okay. Getting lots of rewards out of this. Actually, also a bit of like EXP material and such. I know you exude an air of detachment, evoking a profound solitude as if you weren't really here. I don't know how to establish a connection with you. Your exceptional uniqueness makes me feel inferior. Perhaps this place was never intended for me, yet for fleeting moments I did experience a glimmer of warmth. My ruthless remains unaltered even in the face of defeat. And your hubris is irreparable beyond any hope of salvation. <sighs> What's the point of talking about all this useless stuff all day? How about something tangible, like a glass of drifting wind? Don't forget to add a pretty decoration on it, thank you. Is there a decoration for this thing again? Hmm, arch wine glass. More ice? Art concoction? Soothing soda. It looks interesting. <laughs> I'm wondering what that odd concoction is, so middle eve. Uh, how capricious happiness can be. Reading as the bubbles dancing upon my glass, it vanishes in the blink of an eye. I know here. Are you going to bullying me? I ask you, Bon, have you asked her? Well, within the spacious lounge, a seen drinks move finds no place to dwell, much like this grand hotel behind the dream scheme. We are struggling to find my niche. Or oh, where shall my tent a melancholic soul find its abode? Mm. I'm just here to land that. Ah, I see you're bent in two, right? So pathetic, just like me. <sighs> sure, Shiroban is great at mixing drinks, but given the location, it's only natural that the launch remains deserted and unattended. What's the point of being a drinksmith here? There are no customers, no revenue, much like those unwanted concert trade tickets. And when the curtains are raised, you step onto the stage, only to be faced with a mere handful of people in the audience. It's truly disheartening. Perhaps this launch will go out of business soon. Uh, don't say that, those words won't bring any luck. Is it trying to bully me? That's how it feels. And I'm ready to see its future and I'm talking to accept its present. Uh, might as well have a few more while I'm here. Please give me a class of something that exudes brokenness and is very refreshing. And add the decoration of Miss Robin to it, thank you. What would exude brokenness? Uh, slightly bitter and strong. Huh. Hmm. 
<sighs> Happiness is an elusive treasure, one that needs cherishing, but a trinket all in a single cup. Following the bliss, boundless emptiness once more consumes me. It's time to leave the stage. Surely someone with a life as fulfilling as yours won't even remember me. Maybe meet again when there is light. Interesting that you will like say something like still a bit, um, strong, but the is a bit bitter, but taste broken. <laughs> Hello there, my friend told me there's a new tricks with fear. This was maybe you, right? I have just this before. You seem like a fascinating person to chat with. In that case, let me ask you a secret question. Did Mel did a melancholy customer just leave? He's indeed melancholic. I know you're talking about his looks. Don't you find his demeanor special? I'm a the kind of detachment in iffy vibe. Um, the kind of solitude you expect from a genius. It's just fascinating. Um, talking about this topic uh, makes me feel all flushed. Please make me a drink. I might just order this chewing gum with a little more ice so I can cool down my internal cattle ray tubes. I just shatter some more ice cubes. Uh, chewing gum, was it? This was iced wine glass. More ice. Okay. That's under the doors. Odd concoction. Practitioner's pepper. There you go. Hems a ball night card. Okay. Mm -hmm. A tantalizing taste, indeed. You must be a seasoned drink smith who can easily grasp a customer's preference. By the way, you've only been here for a short while. I wonder if you've noticed that things sound very peaceful outside the lounge. I rose me too. I've always felt something creepy lurking deep in the hotel and the dreamscape. But if I want a quiet place, there's not much of an alternative. It's a frustrating. I can't find a good spot for a date. Uh, when I have a date here at the lounge? No way! There are too many acquaintances here and customers could walk in any minute. It's too embarrassing. As I'm forward, the depth of uh, this hotel seems like the best option, as long as I don't go too far, right? Mm. Oh, that's my idea. I'd love to, but let's not rush things. We've just met after all. Well, it seems you enjoy discussing embarrassing topics. It's making me a bit flustered, to be honest. Give me another drink to cool me down some more. This time, I want something dreamy and super thick. And like before, I want more ice. All my circuits are gonna cut. Uh, 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 gonna try? Uh, gonna fry. Maybe I just place ice cubes on your head. Mm, a dreamy base, very thick. Let's go with the Archer I guess. More ice? Uh, a bit sweet, a bit strong. I am very fake. Hmm. 
Oh, that looks cool. That's what doing a rather short feel like. Sword. You're a perfect drink smith, so skilled and caring. That was a great experience. It was nice talking to you. In my opinion, you're almost as great a drink smith as Shioban. Impressive indeed. I'll drop by next time. Please look forward to my arrival. She's probably just easily embarrassed. Her lady is probably the most normal among all the monsters that you've come in contact with so far. <laughs> well, the same man's back. Hey. Hey, come closer. Let's keep this trust between us. Did the customer not come just now? She's asking a similar question now. Oh. Oh, I see. I followed her right to the door of this lounge and watched her come out. So don't try it for me. What did she talk to you about? And did you mention my name? To mention Shioban. That's a big one. All the monsters here are fond of Shioban. But except for me, of course. I'm not afraid of her at all. Did she mention anyone else? I mean, any other monster? She mentioned the Metal Connect customer. I knew it. I knew it. She just can't get enough of that blasted poet. In his pretentious literary accent, so fascinating that she's still holding on to it. Well, forget it. It's not worth getting worked up about such nonsense. Just do your job and get me a drink. I want something in a large glass that is a little bitter and with pretty colors. You know what pretty means? It means to separate the layers more clearly. Don't make it all cloudy like dishwashing water. It's just fixated on layering colors. Uh, large, slightly better. Why only two layers, though? Uh, hmm. Which could uh what could I play with layer wise? Ah, that's more like it. Not many vegans is this for any. No, I'm slightly impressed with you. Oh, I just remembered something. Uh, were you to me the last time I came here? And did I say I teach you a lesson? Get rid of your baseball bat. Hey, chill out. I thought about it, and I realized that was a bit too aggressive, and there might be some kind of misunderstanding. I apologize for that, and I hope we can be on better terms. So you see, next time that guest comes around, could you put in a good word for me? No need for flattery. Just the random name more often. Will you do me a small favor, won't you? But it depends on my mood. Think about it. It's been a pleasure for you too. If you make me happy, I'll drop by more often. And you'll receive more tips. A great deal, isn't it? You get paid and I get served. A win-win situation for both of us. Everyone in this lousy lounge takes orders from me. What's the point of mixing drinks all the time? Stay on my side and I'm sure you're happy life. Hmm... No freeze. You have an idea what's good for you. I don't have expected anything from a lowly waiter. Making drinks is the only thing you're good for. Give me something in an extra large glass, very sweet, and tastes super intense. And it's gonna have pretty layers. I'm not paying if any of my criteria are not met. Do you think I'll let you leave without paying? Move the mixer first. Nothing about flash and flash, pretty on the outside, useless otherwise. <laughs> it would be kind of position to say yes. 
Okay, extra large. More ice, because ice is always nice for drinks. Very sweet and very strong and three layers. Okay. This would look cooler. It's <laughs> incredibly fake. <laughs> That's a fake boy. Not mad, but this is not the end. You will need to serve me until I leave this lounge. Well, I've calmed down a bit. Um, I've almost finished my drink, but I've not done talking. How long are you intending to work at this lounge? How long do I have to wait if I don't want to see your face again? When you come by, I will be here. Very full of talking to you annoys me. <sighs> Fine. I'll show you how to be a competent attendant. Meet me there when you're done. I'll be waiting. It's still being as a rule to me, but I learned a lot about Tin Man through our chat. You should be willing to be honest with me now. <laughs> I have a meeting to attend. Is the alarm clock waiting for me at the launch? No, oh, it does. The launch is just a few steps away. What took you so long? If I want to get a refill, uh, do I have to wait forever? Check out my watch. You're half an hour behind schedule. And the ice in my class is already made it. How has it been that long? Is that what you should be asking? The customer's always right, and if you can't even get that, then why are you even here? As you have no idea what you want told you, let me fill you in. Let's fix you up. Watch on your new blood. This is what a good launch should be like. Uh huh. What should it be like then? Welcome back, Hey Excellency, the esteemed and illustrious Lord TikTok. It's my foremost honor uh, fortune to have encountered your presence. How shall I extol the sun? Your radiance surpasses the splendor of syrup. At the launch gleams of your arrival. In my heart, you're akin to the... So glad bottle cap. Without you, the entire bottle of so glad. No, all tried would lose its meaning. Wow. This almost feels like a bit... Um, <laughs> kind of like into uh, Okumura's palace in Persona 5. <laughs> Or not like just Kuma, also like uh, Kamoshida. Also a bit similar to that. Where's that, my loyal servant? Now I find myself at a crossword. Show me the answer through you. Dance steps that port uh, portend the future, which perhaps befits this extraordinary journey. And what is my command, Your Excellency? Uh -huh. Yes, the use of the dice indicates that the finest beverage shall be handcrafted by the drinksmith over there. Drinksmith over there? Preposterous! She's not but a village girl. I frowned from the inn. You believe an arrogant, ignorant girl who cannot even trace her lineage to possess the skills to brew the beverage I require? Ha! Huh. How intriguing. Hey, bring me! 
Before the sentence was finished, Mr. Picnic suddenly ran over from a distance, shouting in alarm. That's a terrible news, Master. It's Madam. She she's run away again. Where did she go? She's still inside the lounge. Well, no need to make a commotion. Inform her of my return request her immediate presence. I've told Madam, but she wouldn't listen. She even said that What did she say? She said she's going to be a drinksmith and will never come back. What? How outrageous. I should personally inquire of her. I'm curious, would that drink really work? I uh, mixing beverage is so much fun that you wouldn't want to go home. Yikes. I beg your pardon, I did not intend to keep it concealed from you, and I wish to bring you a surprise. I heard of a skilled tricksmith at a launch, and I decided to pay homage to your greatness. Hence, I came here intending to learn how to craft delicious beverages. Please, I implore you. Do not be angry with me. During this expedition, I gathered numerous accounts detailing your magnificent achievements. Behold, which great hero led the sweet dream troops to triumph against the Trashcan Kingdom? Which hero trampled the presumptuous Tatalov beneath their feet and raised the banner of freedom and equality? We inquire, who is it? The Sword of Battle reply, it's His Excellency, Marshal TikTok. You inquire who is it? The billboard reply is His Excellency Marshal TikTok. You inquire who is it? Replies the entire dreamscape. It is His Excellency Marshal TikTok. Me too, me too. I just wrote a poem for you. Please enjoy it. Behold the renowned general TikTok, in better invincible wisdom profound, valiant and skilled, a warrior's might, conquering his foe Tartalov with his valorous light. <laughs> Such a thought, uh, adulation. I was unaware that my renown had spread so far and wide, yet it is only befitting. However, let me enlighten you. The drinks with is unsuitable. She is but an orphan I took in. She may tend to the tables, yet her abilities to create anything of interest is doubtful. If you don't mind, we'll see you. Good day, you're in the Mr. TikTok. Looks like you have failed to take heed of the lesson I told you. When you speak, bow your head, extend your hands, and look up to me. How often have I instructed you to display courtesy to the guests? Whatever you have, I, I beg your pardon for my transgression. I have nearly arrived at the launch and I'm familiar with the rules here. I employ pardon. Just so much are you afraid of Shiuban? <laughs> Alas, debating with such an ill bred servant is a waste of time. Well, bring me beverages and showcase the extraordinary talents of the personal tricksmith in his team service of Sir TikTok, the illustrious one. In truth, upon learning of your return from your expedition, I've prepared a commer commemorative beverage for your excellency. A better wall. Come forth and announce of honor. What shall this glorious beverage be named? The defeated governor. What, are you being sarcastic? Please, calm me, are you? The name was chosen to make a statement, and the beverage was inspired by your resplendent countenance. The black layer at the base signifies a fierce and savage battlefield. The white layer at the top denotes despair, and the blue layer in the middle represents your composure and unyielding resolve. In your stand as the sole survivor, you retain the will to forge a path through the darkest wilderness. Well said, looking at the drinksmith I took in is very cultured. Learn from her, my servant. Hey newcomer, find a befitting seat for me and bring me my beverage. Hurry! And get you one special drink. Alright. Why do we get a message in the emos game? The alarm club took it away. It's going to drink that beverage. Frankly, I'm good at pretending. You almost let it slip. I do want to make it mad. It did nothing wrong. It's just a rugged piece of metal with a bigger head and it thinks of no more than everyone here. Yeah, not get flat. And let's play kick the can. I'll get Tom in here. Come and help us, new wee drink smith. I shall do the deal with Fennec, I can't wait for the start, fun to start. How about shoving the steel stick into a spring hole and spinning it hard? I, I'm all fired up. Great minds think alike. A spring of who can make my skip a beat, it's gonna be you. And now the moment for vengeance is at her hand. 
We just wait for the currents to rise. The beverage is on the counter across the room and have added some special ingredients to it. Making it, making it run for a couple of hours won't be a problem. Time to teach the disobedient child a lesson. However, this is only its imagined world. Your actions may be hindered, but let's play it by ear. Was your temper with wait two classes? Well, I will take them both. Too sluggish. What kind of way to indulge this is cell phones during working hours? Show some respect. Where are your manners? Show the friends in the light of my pre uh, presence. Bring me my drink. Huh? Why two classes? Can't you even tell the colors apart? This garbage drink is a sheer band specialty prepared. Uh, the bottom layer is black. The middle layer blue and the top layer white. Just a drink. How shall I do it? A beverage of extraordinary taste. This exemplifies the essence of respect and affection. Look at a beverage you mixed before. Could they ever aspire to grace an honor patent's goblet? Wait, why am I feeling a bit sleepy? Is this drink too potent? Well, this can be. I'm the. You're awake? Ha, look at the pitiful look on your face. You've been acting all high and mighty here, but guess what? You're just a nobody in this lounge. And you had the audacity to call me your wife. Huh, who in the right mind wouldn't marry a fool like you? Definitely not me. Ta da! Here comes the drama of vengeance. You were just playing along? But isn't this my dream? So why? I'm the owner of the dream child hostelry and I prepared all those things. I'm sure you understand now, alright? Did I treat you too gently before, or have you entered your rebellious phase? How dare you say that you plucked me from an inn? You've got some nerve. She won't look so scary when she's angry. I never spoil my behaving kids. They need to face the consequences. Pampering them is the worst way to teach them. Remember that. I'll leave the rest to you. Just don't go overboard. <sighs> I've been waiting for this. Could you please bring me the steering stick? I've been wanting to try it for quite a while. <laughs> the subsequent material is not suitable for viewing. This performance ends here. Thanks for watching. See you next time. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have bullied other monsters or teased Chiyoban. I was talking nonsense, it was all just a joke. No, stay away from me! He deserved it. How's it going, Lord TikTok? It's all my fault. I'm so sorry! The drink you made was tasty, and the whole vibe here was awesome. I'm totally loving this place. I will definitely come back again. Well, I'm taking my leave. See you! What's making him so scared? Something is not right. I should follow him outside and check things out. Be careful with the new radio I just found. Don't even think you touch it. <laughs> Don't worry, look, my hands are puny and feeble. I won't break it. I want to hear the sound you mentioned too. <laughs> but we'll be really quick, okay? Hey there, I've come all the way to. A better ready is coming. It has to be such an annoying troublemaker, I'm so sorry. Did, did I hear the word? The big boy doesn't have a brain, and that's for sure. Let's leave him be in the fun. Looks like his problem is resolved for now. Let's hope he gets along with the other monsters in the future, too. Okay. Next round. More deductions. Beautiful enemy. Is there so many drinking drinks that one need now? Solution of freedom, okay. Hey, 
I actually quite like the induction, even though it's quite easy to do. It just goes all the way up to six. Come on. I don't have to finish the mission. Uh, no, now we're good. Oh. The alarm clock was a pain, but now he seems quite prudent when he is calmed down. He was ready. Time to home for business. Oh, okay. You know, you can't uh, we can't understand each other. Despite our efforts to communicate, our paths are destined to remain apart. <laughs> if that's the case, what purpose does language serve? In our desperate cry for understanding, we are an um, exercise in fertility. Tell me, strange tracks, drinks move. Do you hold an answer? Many things are doomed to fertility. <sighs> Seeking answers to such questions is akin to waiting at a station for a ship that will never arrive. Let it go. Let's simply have a drink. Only the warmth of the liquid can offer solace to my tormented soul. Please give me a small glass of tears. I just wish to quietly savor the intense bitterness that life has brought me. If you happen to, and I do mean happen to have some decorations that can remind me of the audience back at the theater, please put it on. I'd like to see it. Thank you. So we are not represents Panic County. I've tricked you on carefully. Okay. Small, bitter, and strong. We have a Panaconian. Extra. I mean, Monero is in Scarp and Agony the most is Kolaki. Wait, what? Huh. Well, let's go with this. Orange does was a piece. You haven't possessed an enchanting touch, effortlessly mending the wounds within me. <sighs> Pressure with emotional transient. The class is empty, yet the void in my heart remains unfilled. <laughs> Thankfully, this delightful drink has made us acquaintances. You know, before I came to this lounge, your was a struggling actor relegated to countless minor roles, plagued by isolation. No direction, no income, and no self esteem. Regrets have permeated my life. Do you think I can still discover happiness? What is happiness anyway? <sighs> a piercing question indeed. Happiness is but a facade. With the world oblivious to the pain and suffering concealed beneath. I'm like a character in a play, confined to mimicking the words of others. I can't change the situation or myself. 
The past continues to haunt me. Even in this paradise, the dreadful nightmare persists, and the sadness within me never fades. That's not something your few drinks can wash away, but... Go on. Uh, it's impolite to expose my wounds without permission. It's better to share sorrows, experience joys, and bid farewells appropriately. Better make an order first. Please give me something in a large glass, as thick as you can make it, and taste a little intense. More importantly, a little more love, please. <laughs> What's the love you mentioned? Once I was firmly obsessed with Blaze Dreams uh, Blaze. Dreams woven from vibrant costumes and makeup. Unfortunately, my love became lost in the past. As I was probably means it's a decoration related to cartoon characters. Hmm. Okay, very thick. Hmm. Good strong. I look happy, but it's mesmerizing to think so intense, but just what I need it. The character stories are got a happy ending. Huh. What I'm seized the march, this drink is so exquisite and I yearn to save its flavor for the remainder of my days. Despite the so clouding my eyes, your kindness and drink mixing mastery have deeply impressed me. Ah, <sighs> farewells always carry a tinge of bitterness, but please do not lament or encounter. My colleague's mood doesn't seem to be getting any better, but it feels like it's trusting me has deepened. I don't tell much more. It looks like we are like soon done with this all. Hello there, here you meet you again. Come on, the corner cast me just left. <laughs> Why so serious? You've been a drink smith for quite a while, and I'm sure you know better than to speak your mind. But I came to see you because I heard something interesting and wanted to share it. Well, if you notice it, don't forget it. Oh, I love gossip. Uh, great, but I'm feeling a bit first, you know. Could you make me a drink first? Hmm, this time I want the uplifting and refreshing thing that I like. Don't add too much ice. I've been feeling under weather recently. I wish she used to ask for a lot of ice cubes, so she doesn't need ice cubes this time because she hasn't brought up any embarrassing topics. So we're going to drink. Mm -mm. So I just read a metal. That should be fine. Mm. I really like this like beverage emoji is there. <laughs> this look really funny. This tastes amazing. Must you understand me so well if only you could stay forever by my side. Well, now to finish my drink, it's time to share the interesting story of you. 
Actually, you stumbled upon Shiobahan's secret by chance. A kind of secret. The kind of secret that would pique anyone's interest, of course. I was wandering around the hotel in the dreamscape when I spotted a gorgeously dressed lady searching for something. I said to come across an outsider in this place, so I followed her for a while. Then I was remembering something, like... She wanted to hang out with Chiu, um, but had been turned down multiple times, so she decided to come straight to the lounge. She even said Chiu Ban would definitely accept her offer this time. It is as if they've known each other for ages. If you were in the late lady's shoes, would you keep uh, trying to contact Chiu Ban? Hang on for invitation. Ah, oh, that's tough. If you say that, it's not easy to suppress what's on your mind. I'm sharing this with you because I'm also holding onto many secrets and I'm hesitant to reveal them. But then again, I'm too timid and those words get stuck in my throat and swallowed back. <sighs> Should I ask my out and board to express my feelings to him? So here's a chance why you have it. Hmm, but it's not that simple. I'd like to bother you to make a drink that is very slightly better in a small class and it has the taste of woody mellow. Just a little ice will do. Just like my cure mood. Upset. Is she worried about something related to Malikoni? Okay, small. Less eyes. Slightly better, very mellow. Okay. There you go. Fantastic! The string is exactly what I wanted. You truly understand me the best. Talking to you has made me feel much better. He seems so tired of conversation matches this girl makes him drinks. If only I could chat with him as effortlessly as you do. Nevertheless, I must take action. I'll come up with a plan. Wait for my good news. Ready to also find Malakoni. Hope the conversation just now can help make it up its mind. It was quite willing to share its inner thoughts with me. Well, the customers know. I'm a bit tired. Let's call it a day. Ah. 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 Are you simple or something? <laughs> What's happening? A real person here? I thought she would put a drink mixer here. You look like a drink mixer to you? Yeah, right. You can even find talking billboards in Dreamscape. Who knows if you're a real person or not? There's a noisy dice and a stupid alarm clock. Once you've seen too many animated objects, you will struggle to tell them apart from real people. So what brings you? Drinks, of course. Didn't you want to tell you? Give me a glass of paper moon. Since you want uh, to be a drinks with you, let's see what you're made of. Mm, I don't think I need a brutal, do I? No, you don't. But if I want to get rid of you, I have my uh, many ways to do that. I want a glass of paper moon. Don't forget. So it's always um, implies something. Shiba never, um, never mentioned that um, Starlet could be so difficult to get along with. I mean, it was obvious that he would be difficult to get along with, not gonna lie, from his descriptions. Mini wine glass, less ice, so good. Blossom to you. Uh, here you go. Not bad at all. Now I see Shiuban did find someone decent to take her place. What did Shiuban tell you? To fix this up? 
We've been working here for a while, so what do you think of those monsters? Um, um, are you screwing yourself? I know exactly what I am, and I don't need you to remind me. They look pretty unique. Although they're a bit eccentric, and can have their own emotional problems. They can be quite adorable once you get used to them. Is that what you're thinking now? Yep. Forget it. It wouldn't. I will, you wouldn't give an answer even if I asked. Humans are all good at lying, and their words don't hold any wa uh, water. You were the one who asked first, right? Huh. Make me another drink. An extra large glass. Treat me with a thick texture. Is this request I forgot for you? It's like he's not, not just here for a drink, but more like testing me. Incredible drinks with a simulator. Uh, here you go. You get a lot of ice this time. Slightly sweet and strong. Red, I'm gonna use this combination. And then. Fake! Make the ball fake! Um, what are we gonna use for thickness though? There you go. Mm. It's actually really very strong. Pick and dreamy. Pick and dreamy sounds good. <laughs> It's indeed the flavor I was hoping for. Your drink smooth skills are more impressive than I expected. Well, making great drinks is not all about managing this launch. There are way more problems to deal with here than you expected. Soon you know what I mean. I guess we will see. Soda is behaving normally. It just sounds, uh, it just doesn't seem to like me. Being drinking smooth is actually exhausting. How did Shuba manage to keep it up? Mm. Keep at it for so long. Oh, there's the other launch. Lady Melancholy. How are you doing? Well, hello there. It's a bit awkward, but I need to ask you a favor. I'm the most trying carrying drinks of you. Oh, I'm really fond of you, the gender type. Alas, if only. He could be as caring as you are. It's well, it's. I have no idea why she asked me to stay here. This is just depressing. Why is it always me? There's so many other monsters, but she asked me to sit alone in this corner after business hours. Is she trying to bully me or something? And tomorrow she would go around spreading my embarrassing story and ostracize me, right? Like. Come on, you actually thought receiving a note meant someone was confessing their love to you? Or that fool will actually fail for it? Did you see that there was an ex uh, expectant look on his face? Priceless. <sighs> What's the pain of making such jokes? I'm not trying to bully you, I, I just want to... Uh... What's going on here? I should talk to them so and find out what they really think. Uh, yeah, it's related for this, I guess. It's, it's, you know, I wanted to ask him to hang out, but I don't know how to go about it. I just be honest, tell him how I feel. I'm good at chatting with people I don't care about, but when it comes to someone I do, how can I say something so embarrassing? Hmm, what about me? Yikes, are you being jealous or something? 
Think about it, all the monsters here like you. Isn't it am amazing to have so much happiness all at once? I'm just I'm just used to saying things that make people blush, but when it comes to the moment of truth, I just can't speak out what I really want to say. Hey there, don't you have some awesome powers? Could you dive into my heart and see what is blocking me? Okay, let's see what her issue is nice. <laughs> uh, do I also have to do this puzzle with her? Of course I do. Um... This one will lead around again, so I'm guessing I'm gonna use this one. not. Mm -hmm. Let's go back first and do the other uh, path. This is not leading anywhere. Huh? Oh, wait. <laughs> Stupid. Wow. I could have just, like, you do done these way. Uh, this is that one, okay. it all or is there one more? Oh god, this is all. Oh, I found my true heart. Oh, I just stopped pretending. It's easy to get hurt if you just tear other spots in your heart. Anyway, thanks for helping me figure out my true feelings. I won't run away anymore. It's frustrating. Why do they have to make fun of me? Isn't there already enough sadness in the world? What a world. I had nowhere to go and now what I finally found a peaceful place. They want to bully me. Ah, stop crying. I did it. I know it's a world, but I just can't shake off my grief. 
I gotta figure out a uh, way to calm it down. Let's step into his inner world. And an Emus Gabe. Okay, nobody likes me, just didn't even choke. What's this puzzle again? Okay, where does it want me to go? Activate, rotate, activate, activate, wait, rotate, activate, rotate, activate, activate. Okay, that was simple. Uh, someone saw it. Uh, it's coming over. See, I'm coming for you. Mr. Jinxman, how did I get here? Here we are. If, uh, I'll find you. You're not in prison. You're my superhero. It's so touching. Uh, I'm not feeling so sorrowful anymore. Look, even my rings are starting to flutter. Life feels full of joy since I met you. The tragedy is finally ending, and the comedy is about to begin. We will get someone is waiting for you. Uh, really? But how can it be? Uh, no, no, I shouldn't stay. I should stay positive. I've got to remind myself that everyone likes me. Mm, maybe not to that extent. Let's go towards the sweet future. Okay. Almost all of them are done. Then I will take my leave, alright? Thank you, you've been so kind. <laughs> alright, alright, enough of the public display of affection. A gentle person like you will be popular wherever you go. If you feel lonely, I'll ask you out next time. But for now, please give us your blessing. Oh, Christ, why have something come about? I'm not inviting you. Hey, next, please, someone help us. This is great for help. It's come from outside your lounge. Wait, it's below. Ah, this dude. Oh, I don't want to die just yet. I just decided to live a happy life from now on. I don't want... C calm down, learning. I, I protect you. Uh. Get back to your senses. You don't recognize us? I won't let you harm them. Come help me, drink Smith. Start has lost his mind. Oh, make sure fighting. Don't get complacent. <laughs> Nothing major. Some value, I suppose. Eternal. Easy, Numbi. <laughs> Here is thunder. Steady. Receive divinity. Oh, great. Good part. Eternal sleep. The dead return. There's more to life. Oh, 
follow my charge. Going. Here, it's thunder. It's this place is unity. Every petal, all will be swept away by the wind. Could raise it, but it should finish us up. Show no mercy. Easy, Numbi. Go, Numbi. Good. Wake up! What happened? How could this be? How even the wisest thing among us has lost its sanity? As of all, it is indeed a heaviness is transient, while sorrow seems everlasting. Who can tell me if we are doomed for ruin? Why were we brought in this illusory sweet dream in the first place? You were so fine last time we met. Why did you suddenly become frenzied? I should form Shiuban as soon as possible. What should we do? You're a smart man, you Twingsmith. So there must be something you can do. Let's bring him back to the lounge first. I'll let you a paw. Okay. Looks like he's okay. He's a regular launch, but why did he lose his mind all of a sudden? Well, um, will I end up like that someday? That's scary. We all end our uh, destined, destined end someday. Why isn't Shiuban here at a time like this? What's she doing? Oh, sorry, guys. Aww. People gag for now. As for you, with stay safe, alright? Mm. I've ceased your message. Message. How are the monsters doing? Did you remember the tap in the hotel in the dreamscape? And you mentioned the friends and monsters you noted that she didn't seem all that surprised. Instead, a touch of fatigue appears on her calm face if she had been expecting it. I just checked on her. Nothing serious. You regain a sense soon. I'm sorry I didn't see it coming. Thank you for your help. Are you hiding something for me? Ciao, I just came back and I'm a bit tired. You're scared for a drink smith, so how about ripping up a drink for me? Let's start with you. What would you all like to know? Hmm. The true purpose of this launch. Hey, don't rush things. The answer to your question is way too nuanced. How am I supposed to answer them all in one go? I feel it approached. Make me a refreshing drink and keep it mired. I'll leave the rest to you. I trust your mixology skills. Hmm. Refreshing and very new flavors. Uh, okay. Hmm. It should be fine. Hmm. It is interesting to make. Always brings back memories. You didn't see you uh, use your magic uh, ability on me, did you? Of course not. Just kidding. I said it because as long as I said opposite, uh, opposite opposed to you. I'd feel super relaxed, like I'm in a warm, cozy dream. Unfortunately, dreams don't last forever, just like this hotel. I'm sorry, I should have explained everything about this dream short history better. Those monsters don't show aggression most of the time because of your drinks. 
The rings uh, of what you can stabilize the emotions. Heavy dang resistor nightmare corruption to some extent. Uh, did you prepare the strings on purpose? Of course. We're talking me a lot of effort to gather the ingredients. Luckily, my efforts paid off. If all these special drinks, those monsters will lose their sanity and start attacking everything around them until until they're beyond recovery. Even with my drinks, they still descend into a frenzy from time to time, and it's happening more frequently now. The entire dreamscape is collapsing, and we are just futilely trying to delay its impact, like pouring cold water into the pot about to boil over. The situation of this launch is far from promising. So that's why I started, became frenzied. Well, the situation is a bit different. They have experienced too many tragic events, so they're naturally wary of strangers in the launch. Don't be fooled by their immature look. Deep down, they're still a little dependent kid. They're just too wary to completely trust you right away. So don't take it personally. I'm sure they'll open up and show their true feelings once they become more familiar with each other. As for me, well, smoothing emotions is what the family is used to doing, so there's nothing complex about that. Used to be the administrator. Yep, I mentioned that before, but not anymore. The sweet dreams through members are props entertaining the guests. No guest would want to hang out with a bunch of monsters that could go wild at any moment. So I lost my job and could only stay in this lounge, taking care of these quirky kids. To me, they're like my family. I'm not leaving them behind. They've gotten so good at mixing drinks, maybe I can trust you with this lounge. As the dreamscape collapses faster, more monsters will go frenzied. The drinks we whip up will only calm them down temporarily, and we have no idea when this whole mess will end. Those monsters need you. Already? But to be honest, maybe that's just your opinion. Life isn't simple even in a dream, and hard work doesn't always pay off. That's just how the world works. I've got some troubles I need to sort out. Please take care of these of those kids while I'm gone. I hope you enjoy it here. Say, come this way. I've got something to talk to you about. The dog wants something from us again. All right. Don't you think Giovanna has been acting suspicious lately? She's still around the lounge these days. Where has she gone? And Chris too. I knew it'd feel the same way. As you know, Giovanna is an amazing woman, so we've been wondering. Since she's been away a lot lately, could it be that she doesn't want us anymore? We've been a pain in the neck lady, and of course a lot of trouble. Maybe she's not into us anymore. She always says she's busy with something, but never spills the beans. Come to think of it, Shiba never mentioned that she's been busy, uh, what she's been busy with. Hey, you drinks with? Let's go outside and find Shiba. It'd be great if you could help her out. Hmm, I need to finish my job at the launch first. No problem, let me make some preparation and figure out where Shiba might be. That's a deal. I promised him to look for Shiba, but I need to finish the launch at work first. If I remember correctly, Starl is the only one who is still troubled by his problems, right? TikTok to this also is coming as a guest again. I finish up the last deductions first though. Rose and rain. It like, looks like it's the one. Imagine sunrise. Okay. It doesn't look like a steep card as it should be. Let's try those two first. Yep, that's a deeper red. Mm -hmm. 
For a long past. Okay. That's a clocky car. Operation Dream Punk, Dream Smith. Alright. <laughs> Why not? Hmm. I was almost finished with that. Nice. That's a quest out. Ah, over there. Ready America are really close. Lots of people are fond of their performances. I wonder how Starlight is doing. Will you show up today? This quest is I mean, I should get this and start it first. Greetings, I'm here for a drink. And this time, I'd like, I would like my visit. Uh, my visit here won't cause any troubles, will it? What would you like? Uh, I want an extra large glass that's sweet and has plenty of color. Thanks for that, Rubble. Why do we want layers? It's so much work. Please pardon me. It's my pursuit of beauty. In my opinion, ripe and, and bright things are beautiful. Why cardiac and monotonous things are ugly? Why is you one that I have to have a drink? I think it's more interesting to add a touch of fun. Did we expect to be come so serious after resolving its emotional issues? Well, let's go. No fruit of real layers. We just like do it full of layers. Mm. Let's go with a dark base. Mm. Really bread. Can lighting it up. Why not? It's just right, I got to enjoy it, and the metal flavor it feels so good. Mixing skills are as excellent as ever. I really enjoy this drink. My mind has become so clear since we last talked. <laughs> this is what uh, salvation feels like. To repay the kindness, I did something incredibly daring. I lied to that frenzied fool and told him that Chiuban had called him to the lounge. I believe they will show up any minute now. I believe we'll be able to end the situation when they arrive. I really lied to him. That beast doesn't trust anyone except Chiuban. If I hadn't done that, he wouldn't get a chance to talk to them. As a red, can you make me another drink? This time I want a large glass with a strong taste and a thick texture and with a few more layers of colors. Is this too much to ask for? If it's too much trouble, I change it right away. You've been so polite to me, I'll just fulfill the request. Okay, large, strong, and thick, three colored layers. Mm. 
Oh, wait, it has to be specific three colors. Okay. There you go. You do your laying genius. Sweetness is just right. Sweet. Literally. Sweet. I so let for a little feels like all the gears in my body are shaking. Every corner of my insides has been has been lubricated. I'm feeling so satisfied. Well, thank you for the treat. That fool will be here soon. Here's a piece of advice. When you're talking to them, try to make them reveal their true thoughts. What they say is completely different from what they really think. I hate the type. I like me. I never had my fiery soul. <laughs> I take my leave now. Good luck with your conversation. Alright, now that I've resolved all of the other monsters' problems, it's time to have a chat with Starlet. The alarm clock was lying about you while I'm calling you over, right? Well, if you've got something to say, don't say it. Where's recovery going? It's got nothing to do with you. Looks like we've been talking for quite a while. Get me a drink first. The same one I ordered the first time. Do you still remember? Uh, I think. You're how foolish you are. I'll just tell you, it's Paper Moon. Don't get it wrong this time. Okay. Uh, mini wine glass. Less eyes. So glad. Awesome. And milk. Well, this is exactly what I wanted. And its flavor remains the same. You do seem to have a good memory. Actually, we caught a lot of things. All the same thing because Hugh Bun removes the preference of all the monsters here. She remembers clearly what flavors each monster likes and what uh, requirements they have for their drinks. You may have quirky tastes that even we ourselves don't recall the reason for, but she trusts you with them. It's amazing. Hmm. Oh. So, we're just trying to test me. Hmm. Then do, do you remember what the other man monsters like? Uh, no, you guys remember it all vividly. Your sound hasn't been around for long, but it's already filled with so many monsters. Have you forgotten someone? Oh, the Brompus uh, alarm clock. Let's not mention him, but if someone tries to mess with this place, he's always the first one to jump in and stop the trouble. It's all kind of mundane, but look back on it, it's fun. Oh, just look at me chattering away. Make me another drink, please. I want a drink that's large, very sweet, and tastes mellow. Best if it's refreshing. Perhaps I need to calm down. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ich habe die Flare Options die ganze Zeit nicht gemacht, weil es beim ersten Mal sozusagen ist, die kaputt gegangen ist. Aber dieses Mal. <lacht> oh ja, gut. Mm, very sweet, mellow and refreshing. There he goes. 
It is great. I've been observing you for quite a while, and you're becoming more and more like a skilled Kingsmith. Now that I've said so much, it's your turn now. A good Kingsmith shouldn't just listen, they should be able to guess what's on the customer's mind. You've been in this lounge for some time. What have you noticed? I really care about this lounge. Why do you say that? Mm. I really care about the other monsters. You're sharp for a temporary drink smith. What else have you figured out? Tell me. Actually, you didn't go frenzy back then, right? Go on. Mm. You are trying to scare me into leaving. Get me a large glass with a touch of brokenness and a hint of sweetness, but at the same time, it needs to have a thick texture. I really want to try that now. Keep at it. it looks like I'm getting close to what they're really thinking. Mm, okay, the large. Next. Slightly better and strong. I can't do it with that, if that's supposed to be fake. Um, I like this video because there are a lot of things I can't get out of my head. As I know, we sweet dreams through our creation of the family to entertain the guests. The work that Shiobang gave you was to calm us down, right? It seems you don't really understand what this goal really means to us. If you want an answer, come to the halter in the dreamscape. I'm exactly about done with this. Oh, okay, max tip reached. <laughs> Not even getting any more tips on top of it. Sad. I'll go see what Shiobang is up to when I'm done here. Now I need to chat with Starlet. Gallagher, come to me. So, with that, I have every character now. So. I mean, those will just complete themselves on their own now. So, we're done with, like, drink mixing. Wait, who shared that with me? I don't know. You've come after all. Let's get it started. There's no point in repeating arguments, as only facts can guide us to the path. I've prepared a mind space for simulations. Watch closely and see what kind of life we sweet dreams true members are actually living. What would you choose if you were the one at the crossroads? Okay, let's go. I'm going to a weird place. Is this the hotel in the dreamscape? There's a dream bubble. Uh, of course I know that. So there's no around. Where's this bus coming from? 
Dream Robots are appearing in the hotel as a sign that the dreamscape is collapsing. The nightmare is spreading and the Sweet Room's troops has been corrupted and become frenzied. For the family, this is a big problem that must be solved. Although for us, it might not be the same. What are you trying to imply? You must reach that room. Go experience it for yourself. I've made a few adjustments and you will appear in my form in this space. Remember, the sides may be false, but everything you're about to see did happen before. Okay. Let's play True for Dare! The person who gets caught must choose between True for Dare. Once you've completed a challenge, you can select the next one. Who should we start with? I prefer to be passive. I don't want to be the one who confesses first. You're not going to bully me, are you? Well, I know it's about, but I'm pretty sure you'll agree to pick on me. Uh, that's not how you play. Well, let's think of a way. How about we start with the tin can? The big one should give way to the smaller ones. Nothing wrong with that. Alright, let me show you how it's done. Watch this. So, truth or dare? I choose truth. That is not funny at all. <laughs> Alright, I ask a question. We are most afraid of? Shiobahn. That's cheating. It doesn't count. Oh, well, why not? It's my turn now. I'm going to pick... Hey, you, the red guy over there. Step up. Uh, I'm here. Did I call you? Go back. I mean, yeah, you. I will trust you. Oh, me? Yeah, uh, now I'm asking, who's your favorite one to be with? I haven't said that truth truth yet. But fine, I guess I can answer this question. My favorite is, well, you know, the answer is good to me. I go with there. All right, then. Blink three times. It's simple. Then I'll start. Oh, that's just like how blinking means what I'm changing the monitor screen. Next, I'm going to choose some. Who shall I choose? Why are you staring at me? Are you trying to bully me? <sighs> I don't know what I think like this. No, not at all. I'll go for the big guy over there. Are you choosing me? Why is she panning me? Wait, can she see me? Yeah, you. True for there. My choice is. You go there. Alright, I'm going to try this. Can you perform the trick again? Again? Really? Yeah, the trick. Come on, I can't wait. Uh, let me give it a try. <laughs> Why is the cow mochi in the trick? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Why is that? What is this supposed to be a trick for? But okay. I haven't this much fun in ages. Also, I'm out of seeing you like this. No, oh, it's so much fun. Yeah, so much fun. It's really that making fun of others is what makes comedy, but still. Now, it's not from laughing so hard. How did you come up with the trick? You really need something else. That's exactly what you did back then. You don't need to know the details. You can laugh uh, so hard is all you need to know. Here we go. Mm, it's always a pleasure to spend time with friends. Are you willing to give up this life? Uh, here we'll, we'll find two doors. A door on the left means yes, and a door on the right means no. no really me this. It's always a pleasure to spend time with friends. Are you willing to give up this life? Uh, now, why should you give, why should you give up uh, spending time with your friends? If we need to have a life ever since we broke free from the family's control. Of course, the nightmares has left everyone emotionally unstable and conflicts have increased. But at least we don't have to worry or fear anything. We are free now. We can decide which path we want to take. Now go back. You haven't reached the end yet. Interesting how the games may uh, make you play with you ever. What's wrong with you? Why should I keep your useless cells around if you can't even roll the dice right? I I'm sorry, I won't make this mistake ever again. Do you want a bigger small? Yes, can we bigger small? I really that stupid. Can't you see the situation on the table? If most guys bet on the big side, you roll small. Otherwise, roll big. Have you forgotten what I told you? 
We're the most miserable loser win once every few rounds. If someone questions us, find an excuse about having a tummy ache. The banker doesn't have to win all the time, but must ensure nobody loses too much money. Do you remember now, you buffoon? I need to use the bathroom. I'm asking you to lie to the guests, not to me, you fool. Bring me the weapon and I'll make sure you never forget it. Please don't do that. Scram you, stupid dog. All you do is chew on your stupid soda bottles. You can't even protect the house without causing losses. Get lost now. Uh -huh. That's so scary. C can't bear to watch such brutal scenes. Let me cover your eyes. Uh, maybe forget about it for today and do it some other time? Did I ask you anything, huh? Did I? This is just a warning. One more word and you're gonna get it too. I see. Ah, I'm in a bad mood. But I'll take it out on you. You were made for entertainment, but you can't do anything right and keep wasting my money. You're good for being my practice dummies. What's the point of warning you, worthless piece of junk? Why don't I just mess you up and sell you off parts? <laughs> I can only want to make super uh, petting useless. Can you hear me? Yeah. So now you think you're gonna... Uh, you're some kind of hero? You big nitwit. You're gonna get it too. You think you're smart. You think you've seen it all. Ha, huh, nonsense. As long as I'm in charge, I can... punch you as much as I want. Don't even think about fighting back or getting help from anyone. I am uh, punish you until you're scared. You only listen when you're scared, right? You try to grab your trusty baseball bat, but it's nowhere to be found. The whip keeps hitting you. Not really causing much pain, but humiliation is so real. Say something. I'm just gonna stand there and watch them get, uh, get hit. Do you really think you can erase the past and change the future by yelling at these illu illusions in front of you? Like I, uh, like I said, you are the former me. Here we go. It's the same two doors as before. Mm, ah, the familiar sailing. <laughs> you don't left me chest and I don't remind me snow. Riddle me this. Losing your freedom and being at the mercy of others is painful. Do you want to escape that kind of life? Well, of course you want to escape it. No, no need to think about it twice. I let a miserable life when we serve the family. It may be called the sweet dreams true, but there's nothing sweet about our dreams. Now that we've decided to help Shiuban and make us return to the sweet dreams troops, do you know what that means? We we'll lose our freedom and be at the mercy of others again. No one cares about what mere tools like us think. Breaking free is the only way to find happiness. The nightmare may be a problem for the bear family, but for us it's our only chance to escape. Even if it drives me to a frenzy, I'm willing to risk everything at this point. What about you, Ban? Now go back. You haven't fulfilled your duty yet. Head to that room. And that room is... I want to speak to your administrator. I can't believe you lost my room card. My luggage is in your lobby. Who's gonna take responsibility if I'm late? Please wait for a moment, I'll go ahead and it for you. A moment? How long is that exactly? The family never waits when they are charging for our room or collecting money. But I have to wait? I want to see the person in charge right now. No delays, no excuses, or there will be consequences. But our administrator... <sighs> Could we maybe not involve the administrator? How about this? I'll go get the concierge right away. I'll be quick, I promise. I'll tell me what to do. Shut up. I want an administrator. Now. I don't care what you do. Just get your administrator or else. <laughs> Does this happen frequently? Yes, often. Pretty much every day. Let's start up here. I think you have the answer now.
Yeah, well, you find a door. Is this the end? The door on the left means yes, and the door on the right means no. Riddle me this. Now that you have uh, seen the real past, do you think we should return to the Sweet Dreams troop? The so called normal life is nothing more than just slavery for us. To us, abnormality means freedom. If you can't enjoy the Sweet Dreams, why not embrace the other side? So, what's your choice? Don't you already have an answer? Perhaps. We had Wyman back here again. What are you waiting for? How much longer do you expect me to wait? Apologize for keeping you waiting. I'm the administrator, so please let me know how I can help you today. You're the one? I might look respectable, but you can't even teach your tools how to do things right. Are you too stupid or too incompetent and too much this chunk? Have I just not noticed before or has she a halo now? It's like a Halonian. Because I don't think I've seen that halo on her before. I apologize for all the troubles caused. The Irish ceremony is willing to compensate you. Compensate me? Can you even afford it? If you're a measly salary, your compensation wouldn't even cover the room bill for one system hour. And you have the nerve to talk about compensating me? <sighs> this is a dog lost my room card and I want it back. Just the one that's lost, not the others. If the dog can't find it, then you do it. I don't care if we have to beg, borrow or steal. I'm going to get out. What did I say? I said, I want you to disappear from Paniconi. You can make yourself scarce on your own, or I can arrange it for you. Your choice. Wait, I'm a guest of honor invited by the family. How dare you talk to me like this? <laughs> a guest of honor, huh? Well, let you in on a secret. Not only do I dare to talk to you like this, but I also can do something about it. Oh, is an invitation in your pocket? Let me check it and see. It's signed by Maven, head of Dire Assembly. And we have an invitation from Maven, huh? So it's okay if I tear it up, don't you think? In the blink of an eye, the gorgeous invitation is torn to shreds. Colors drain from the Dream Chaser's face instantly. Well, and that you're no longer a guest invited by the family, you're just a nobody in the miserable backed case. Who bullied those little guys? Now would you kindly vacate the promise? You're nuts. I'm going to file a complaint. There will be consequences. An order just exits that way. Farewell. Who's the lady? A new administrator? Oh, I don't know her, but she looks so cool when she was calling that bad guy. <laughs> I agree too. You guys are members of the sweet dream troops, right? Don't be too polite to vermins like that. Because the more placating you are, the more they walk all over you. And remember, if you get bullied next time, just come to me. Cheers, buddy. Is it Shioban before she became a Jinxmith? That was our first encounter with Shioban. You don't have to hard to leave her, do you? No, please listen to my question. Do you think we should return to the Sweet Dream Troops? As a than slavery for us. This is abnormality means freedom. But we've lost something else. In an instant, the world starts to tremble violently. The storm is cascading out, forming a new sentence entirely. Do you want to leave Shiova? No, oh, this one's changing. Yeah. I said I wanted to hear my thoughts, but in the end, it pulled out of its own. Let me help you make his final decision. You found the ultimate answer. What's even more important than freedom is companionship. Is that the answer you've been hoping for? I don't know. Well, who really knows? Also, reaching this room should have been impossible because the room card was lost. But someone helped you and helped us out. Even without a room card, you managed to open the door. It's time to leave. This thought experiment has come to fruition.
Blaming the stream is much more tiring than a fight. Shioban was right. Now admit that you're an extraordinary dreamsmith. You're a perfect fit for the dream shot, hus dream shot history. On behalf of all the members, welcome aboard. Thank you for what you've done. I hope by next time. Thank you for everything. I'll have resolved all the master's problems. Time to investigate Shioban. Got some time now. We promised to meet up with Shiva. Let's get going. I'm ready. See you later. Also, I had the cocktail introducing. I had the guns message. Uh, I did keep the messages for all of the side quest stuff. Mm. Little copyright protection. If you're interested, please find the yellow hat for Pesci employee. Uh, what? Okay, but that's just a random side quest. Platon contractor, can you bring that extra something? Duty incidents, pentagonic film is short stuff. Uh, outsourcer, okay. Hi, this is Toka speaking. You have soil? <clears throat> Hi. <clears> How? <throat> Jadala. Hmm, sure thing. No. <laughs> Was there actually like song in idle, uh, um, idle animation? There you are, I've been waiting for you. I told him that we would be at the launch today, and now I can do whatever we want. Mm, that's, uh, that's great, what's your plan? The Rory Soda Dog will always be your most reliable partner. Out of never left a hold home, my handsome and keen nose will lead us straight to Shiobun. Here the golden hour is huge and crowded, so stick close and don't get lost. Alright. Time for a break. Silent mode activated. They're actually here. Let me get some tongues. Thank you. Great sparkle. Hey girl, is walking your dog, huh? You look so happy. <laughs> you know, I think he's the one taking you for a walk. What are you doing here? I'm going around where I want. Plus, the dreamscape is a mess, and I've got mountains of cleaning up stars to do. You've got something super important to do. Hey, yeah, uh, talking dog, so cute. I'll bring you a gift next time, but for now, I've got work to do, so I'm out of here. I sparkle here for this kind of random. We got shiny stuff and so many people, it's so lively out here. A black swan? <laughs> the desk clocky. This place is so spacious, perfect for a game of float stick. A float disc. I almost forgot. Let's find Shiobun first. So many scents mixed up here. Are you looking for me? Chill out, just kidding. You seem a little troubled. How about I throw a fortune card for you? What's your plan? Just doing a favor and returning the favor. Well, that's done. I'll cut you by sand. Let's go. Now go. Seize the opportunity you thought slips away. What really are people that are we gonna meet randomly? How many details is he making? What the hell? Look at Shiobun and appears next to her. I think I've met her. Hey, it's the bad guy who tried to take Shiobun away from the launch. How did they end up together? I'll take Shiobun back. Hold on, not so fast. Let's think of one eavesdrop on the conversation. Oh no, okay, she actually has like the halo thing now. As I said, staying at the rundown launch is a total waste of your talent. 
you had just listened to me earlier, you wouldn't be in this mess. Lucky for you, the family's head is in a good mood, so I take you to see her. Just be careful with what you say. Don't worry, you haven't forgotten who taught you the basic of, of acting, have you? Well, be careful. Good to know. And don't spend all day obsessing over those monsters of yours. I'll handle them. Now let's get going. Are you okay? Uh, let's head back. Already giving up too quickly. You're back. I was worried about you guys. She, won't, she doesn't want us anymore. <laughs> what nonsense are you talking about, little dog? You think you can fool us with the pathetic tiny brain of yours? I'm telling the truth. The drinks will solve it too. She, won't, she left with the bad guy who showed up at the lounge last time. She doesn't want to stay there anymore. Oh my god. Lies. Nothing but lies. Trust, uh, trust has never existed from the beginning. Is that true? Don't just stand there. There are troublemakers out there everywhere. Watch out. These monsters are fair and aggressive. Don't let your guard down. They won't hurt anyone. What the heck? Why is a human in this hellhole? You've been ordered to wipe out all the monsters in the halter in the dreamscape. Let's just do our job. This is our lounge. We don't let anybody do anything bad. No time to explain them. I've got to stop them first. Let's beat up some idiots. Some value, I suppose. Eternal. Liquidation! <laughs> Eternal step. Dead return! <laughs> A foregone conclusion. Here, it thunder! <laughs> Bloom. So this is the Repent. warmth of life. <laughs> There's more to life. <laughs> Let the valuation begin. Pose. Okay, then let's do some. Show no mercy. Yeah. Every petal and all will be swept away by the wind. No risk, high reward. Go nappy. You chose the wrong enemy. Here is thunder. Hey, that's all, John. Welcome to the chat. Oh, wait, this Kraya guy is way too tough. <sighs> what the heck are you doing? You're having those monsters fight against us. Are you nuts? They really won't hurt anyone. Are you kidding me? Stop talking nonsense. This is not Honkai Impact 4. This is Honkai Star, yeah. <laughs> Star Rail. <yeah. laughs> More, well, they are just animated objects to entertain guests. They can easily be. Uh, Placed. It can be easily placed. It's really worth all this trouble to protect them. No, they're not just blow objects. Enough of a naive kindness. Can I take responsibility if someone gets hurt because of those monsters? What's more, they are corrupted by the nightmare. Even if they seem harmless now, they will show their true colors at the slightest provocations. Monsters are monsters, beyond redemption. 
I give one last chance to think it over. I'm leaving a few harsh words to Blano from Remembers. Take the leave for now. You can clearly hear something from behind you. But so, um, nonetheless, to answer the question. That's nice. I'm trying it. That's fine. What's going on here? This sounds if uh, been here. I'll contact the head of the Platon family uh, right away. That's not the most urgent problem now, Shiba. You should check on them first. Uh, they wanted to capture all of us and they said they were just a bunch of nervous trash. What should we do? Oh, this is so scary. They lock us in and leech us like hell. And leech us like hell. Despair uh, this is clutching my heart, so stifling. I'm about to suffocate. It's too much to handle. They said mean things and even hurt tin, tin Man. I have fighter scoundrels, no matter what. Shiba, are you gonna abandon us? That's why you send those baddies to get rid of us, right? What nonsense are you even talking about? I never wanted to abandon you guys. We would have heard it all. I heard everything you guys talked about. You wanted to go back to the family and continue to form a career. And nothing but unruly monsters just a burden to you. We can't do anything unusual. We bigger all day long and we may lose control any time. So you have to stay in this lounge forever. That's why you hired a new Twink Smooth. We've been thinking about leaving a while now. No, I hired Tomo because their emotions are too intense to be calmed down by words. If you don't handle it well, they might go into a frenzy again. What's wrong? You used to be so articulate, but when it really matters, why don't you say anything? Is it because you're afraid of saying the wrong thing and making them even angrier? I make you just shut up. Mm, don't think you can order me around, I'm not listening. Back then, there was a fool who gave up her acting career to become a Twinksmith, and she always said with confidence that Twinksmith is an art of communication. Now that you're a Twinksmith, why don't you solve the problem the best way you know how? Can you please tell me make me a drink now? Yeah, maybe that. Yeah. Make me your best drink, or one that you think suits me best right this now. We've known each other for quite a while, so what do you think is the drink that fits me best? I'm looking forward to your answer. Is it like... Hmm. 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 Let's see what we're gonna go for. I'm trying to get the specific make sure you would. Perfect, Mm, what an intriguing flavor. Time is summer, so a bit straightforward. I removed it to protection from, uh, from my heart. 
During this time, please use your powers to let everyone know how I'm really feeling. I won't hide anything anymore. You will see the real me, the genuine me. I'm ready. Okay. We're doing like an Animusuke thing on here too. I moved to protect. Uh, doing this, please use some magic ability to let everyone know how I'm really feeling. Shall we begin? I'm ready. Now let's go. Team shot, host very cool. Photo, okay. This is the dream shot hustery from the past. The furnishing is very different from how it looks now, and the monsters are nowhere in sight. Mm. Oh, she about a Mr. Pickwick are over there. I bought a new radio at the store around it. You're always saying the lounge is called Lonely, right? Well, check this out. It really does the trick. Try listening to the radio when you're bored. The programs from the Iris family won't leave you bored. Thank you. I will cherish it. By the way, you've been staying in this lounge for quite a while. It's about the time I give you a name. Since you enjoy listening to the radio so much, why don't I call, call you... I've got something interesting in mind. What's that? From now on, your name is Mr. Bigwig. My name is Mr. Bigwig. An awesome name. Love it. I'm not sure why you would draw a connection with like him um, enjoying to listen to radio and then calling him Mr. Bigwig, but okay. <laughs> Reporting to Mr. Bigwig. Recently, the family sealed off the hotel in the Dreamscape. I'm planning to explore its depths again and see if there are any other sweet dreams troop members who have been abandoned like you. Requesting your instructions. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. That's right. Although I want to open a launch, I'm still lacking a fair few things now that I look at it. How can a proper upscale launch be empty? I have to see what I can do. Oh, we get a jigsaw fragment. Okay. Are you gonna do a jigsaw puzzle here somewhere? Mm. Yeah, okay, here's Spade. Mm, but this is terrible space. I woke up and found myself here with nobody but <laughs> monsters. What bad luck. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, I need a bathroom and I'm nervous, but where is it? Uh, it's um, my peer, Mr. Dice. 4 plus 2 minus 3. Is the result big or small? Big, it's big. 4, time, four times 4 minus 2, and then divided by 6. Is this result big or small? S small, it's small. A squared divided by 4 minus 4, and then divided by 4. Is the result big or small? I have a little tummy ache and I need to use the bathroom. <laughs> These questions are just too hard. It's natural if you can't handle these questions. Small sized uh, sweet dreams troops members don't have good computation abilities. I'll ask it those questions just to see if it's becoming competitive. Or competitive. And luckily, it seems like the nightmare corruption on it is still not too deep. Will you come back with me if you don't mind? Come back, but ram. I formed a lounge in the depths of the hotel in the dreamscape for those abandoned. Sweet dreams troop members like you. There you won't have to work, just a family. The only rule is no fighting. You join us? It could be dangerous for you to stay in the sealed hotel all alone, and you'll feel lonely without any company. But if you joined us, you will have a family. Family? Then can I take bathroom breaks when now I want? Of course you can. You can do whatever you want without any restrictions. And there won't be any bullying in the name of discipline. I won't allow what happened before to happen again. Follow up if you're interested. It's time to go home. Okay. I'll return to the lounge. 
Why is she collecting them though, even though she has like worked with them before? Oh, we got a new partner, Shioban. Let's give Mr. Dice a name too. <laughs> what the coolest name you can think of. The, um, the kindest guess people just by hearing it. Well, I was terrible at naming characters when I wrote scripts. Uh, I see you have some spades on your lie. So maybe I'll just call you a spade. Or that's casual. I think that's a great name. It suits you. Huh? Does it suit me? You, you seriously, dog. <laughs> that's a silly dog. I stop. No fighting there. If you're so ecstatic, come help me set up the launch. Why is that a jigsaw puzzle? Uh, can attempt, but I don't think it will actually. Oh, can finish it. Mm. Design is sophisticated and it fits well with the whole atmosphere. Finally, it's starting to look like a lounge. But is there something missing? Something just doesn't feel right. Uh, it's because there are no customers yet. It would feel more like a launch if it were filled with customers. Wait, <laughs> what kind of counter is so clean? It has to be paid with paper money and chips, uh, and chips to bring out the vibes. Ah, I get it. If I could have prepared the ingredients for mixing the drink. I don't really need chicks or the respective item appeared in the launch. I can understand it now. I'm currently watching the process of Shioban meeting with the monsters and building the launch together. Only the most important moments were preserved. With the Shioban's inner world, she's revealing her past to regain the monsters' trust. Let me help her reveal the whole scenario. If the vision is getting darker, is it time to jump into the next memory? If you're brave to keep hanging out in this shabby lounge and play house with those monsters, don't blame him, the Iris Army for not saving a spot for you. Certainly, you're not lacking, uh, taking your future seriously enough. The status within the family, the superficial flowers and applauses, what can I do with any of that? You're the one who's gotten caught up in it, Amiki. Let's go, Mr. Bigwig. Oof. I don't read and check out the timeline of memory advanced. Shipan still plans to stay here and continue searching for the abandoned sweet dream troops uh, deeper in the hotel in Swimscape. Mm. Is it down here? Yeah, okay, it looks like it. Three dreams are as fickle as fantasy filled soap bottles. <laughs> Lost them some lies, and passion arises from ignorance. Are you here just to bully me? Not a ball. She, mm, she ban wants to help you. We are part of the sweet dream troops, weren't you? The family abandoned you in the dreamscape. <sighs> I've always been on my lonesome. If the acceptation was never. Um, Envisaged, how would one be considered abandoned? We speak like a normal person. I set up a lounge nearby where no one will bully you. There you can meet others from the Street Dream troops who are in the same situation as you. Will you come with me? Are you sure? No one will bully me there. Yes, I won't allow it at least. Do so I still need to participate in plays and act out roles? No, you don't. Or perhaps you can if you're interested. Are you really, really sure? No one will bully me? Are you actually expecting a yes from me? I'm leaving. Do you want to come with me or not? Take me with you. Okay. Medicone. What's next? I heard it was a lounge here. This is the first time a monster actually shows up here. Yes, I'm the owner of this launch. Judging by your appearance, it seems like the nightmare hasn't affected you, right? Uh, at least my mind has been unclouded so far. Tell me, what's your purpose in bringing back these abandoned monsters? 
A sign of a business, is it? Now that you manage to avoid the impact of the collapsing dreamscape, leave and find a safe place. Then why is still at the dreamscape yourself? I've unfinished business. Listen, even if you're not showing signs of frenzy now, as part of the sweet dreams troop, the nightmare will eventually corrupt you. So leave now and find a safe place where you still have your sanity. But similarly, as long as someone's part of the sweet dream troops, there's no actual safe place for them. Show me your lounge. Okay. We're back. <laughs> Some new friends. Alright, listen up. In this launch, we'll do what I say. When I give an order, you follow it. Got it? Now, if you understand, be a good troop member and clean the toilets. What do you say? Uh, I knew someone would bully me in the end. Stop your nonsense. Relax. There are no such rules in this launch. Oh, I need to give you guys names. Mm. How about I just call you Melancholy? Uh, the name doesn't really fit me. I mean, I'm not melancholic and I'm not poetic at all. You are like really melancholic. <laughs> Besides, melancholy encompasses more than just an emotion. It's an attitude toward the world. You really should hear what you said. The name suits you perfectly. <laughs> Perhaps this is what those customers call yuppies? <laughs> Yuppie? Is that what how it's spelled? Ah, why you P P I E? Yeah. <laughs> it's your turn now. Well, let me see. Right, already have a name. It's Starlet. Huh? Uh, I don't even know what to say, my friend. <laughs> Come on, big guy. I really seriously called Starlet. What kind of Kyrgyz style is that? <laughs> Show some respect. Don't make fun of people's names. Sorry, I didn't mean to poke fun, but it's just too hilarious. <laughs> Starlet, do you twinkle, Starlet? Twinkle, twinkle, little star. <laughs> mm, hey now, you won't like to see me mad. Alright, let's get back to setting up the lounge. With new members on board, we finish it up in no time. I need to have melancholy and starlet. <laughs> hey! Okay. More jigs are puzzling. Mm. We go there. We need there. And up. And up. And up. I've got everything I need. Don't I look like a drinksmith when I stand behind the counter? Our launch is all set and ready to roll. It looks uh, looks awesome and grand. <laughs> Finally a place to call home for a good while. I'm so touched. There's truly no place like home in the world. Have thought about your next, about next step? If we stay here, they will eventually go berserk. What will we do then? I'll figure something out. Maybe there's no permanent solution, but at least they can have a happy life like this. When the sweet dream troops get corrupted by negative emotions, they turn into the dream show troop and end up being pursued by the family. They've got nowhere to go except the sealed hotel in the dreamscape. Will they stay in this hotel until they are wiped out? That won't happen to them, not under my watch. I promise you. The lounge is all decorated, but Lady and Tin Man haven't appeared. Seems like the memory backtrack has to continue. Which is taking quite a while, actually. The dreamscape is collapsing. There aren't many sweet dream troops members who can keep the sanity. Come on, let's go deeper into the area. Shiobahn is untired. Shiobahn does look exhausted. It should be nearing the end soon. I should be nearing the end soon. This scary. 
I don't want to aid you people. Leave me alone. Go away. I'm not some berserk monster. Relax and listen. It's okay now. We won't hurt you. Just take a breath. Oh, my eyes and see? I'm not a monster. Just an ordinary human being. And a handsome dog. Oh, you see, I got lost in this maze-like place and couldn't find my way out. Could you please show me the way? Sure thing, come with me. You're talking in a weird way, just like those guests do. Well, you used to be a superstar entertaining those guests. I've been on some amazing stages. Superstar? <laughs> it's been a while since I've heard that word. Do you enjoy being stage? Yeah, for sure. Being loved by so many guests and shining on the stage is a true blessing. A true blessing, alright? If you like the stage so much, I would just call you Superstar. But we already have a starlet. Alright, let me think again. C can I call myself Lady? I've always envied those guests in fabulous clothes, just like Elegant. Sure, you can call. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Sure, you can call yourself whatever you want. So, shall we head home? Thank you. I'll be right behind you. Hey, Jigsaw Fragment. And where does mm, the TikTok guy come in? Mm. I just randomly popped up. Call the administrator. What do you mean it's temporarily closed to the public? Is that how you treat your customers? Do you even have a smidgen of his back for your customers? Basic etiquette? I also fancy the monster in your lounge. That's scary. Didn't you say the lounge is totally safe? No, it's not frenzied. The sweet dream troop member is just grumpy. What would you like? A drink, of course. I the drinks with you. Fetch me something. I'm dying of first. Sure, I can make it whatever you want. I want to drink that slightly sour, not too bitter, super sweet, refreshing, fruity, and with a little fizz. Hurry up! I don't think I have all those ingredients. What? How do you open a lounge without decent ingredients? What a joke! You can't even whip up a decent drink? I'm leaving. Hold on! I'm not waiting any longer. I'll, I'll make you the drink you want, just give me a moment. Here you go, exactly what I asked for. Don't get ahead of yourself, I've met plenty of people like you, all high and mighty. Thinking they rule the world. But guess what? They all end up bowing before me. Fine, I will give it a try. If it doesn't impress me, your launch will have to shut down. Nope. Oh, what's happening here? My head feels a bit dizzy, like I've had a strong drink, but somehow I'm feeling calm. Hey there, nice to meet you. Greetings, my lady. You're absolutely stunning. Would you mind if I. Yeah, I'm not interested in your heart at all. <laughs> What's the expression on the, of the beer mug there? What's oh, really a miracle burger, Shiba? What did you do? It was just a little experiment. I added some special ingredients that help calm it down. Seemed like it worked pretty well on our crumpy customer. Although, maybe I added a bit too much. Hey, uh, hello, mister. Oh hey, did you call me? I'm in a wonderful mood right now. If you need anything, just feel free to ask and I will seriously consider it. So from on now, you'll be a regular at this lounge and I'll make sure to serve you delicious drinks. Sounds good? Oh, and you need a name. Oh, this is giving me a headache. I'll just pick one from the show I just acted in. Let's go with Timman. It suits a big guy like you. A bit tactless and all. Alright, that's how that's it. Is that my name now? Yeah, so that's your name. Don't forget it, because that's what all the monsters and I will call you at the lounge. Because names, you know, they form our initial bond. No, oh, I see. Mm. Ah, and this is a group photo. Shiban, here, come here. <laughs> We've got a surprise for you. Hey, just don't get all teary-eyed with joy and start springing tears everywhere. Hey, all this secrecy. What's the surprise all about? Yeah, it's a special gift for we've prepared just for you. 
the more half the words, the harder they are to say out loud. Go ahead, come on. Jiban, I will leave these final steps to you. No, there are more suitable people available. Right, Miri Mr. Trigsmith. I have to watch if Jiban here can actually see me. Don't make a fuss, go on. <laughs> Alright. Mm, you go there, you go there, 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 and there. Time to celebrate the grand opening of our lounge. Yeah, it's a great opening, but I don't think there will be any other customers coming here except for you guys. Even so, it's still worth celebrating. When we first arrived, there was practically nothing. Everything is set up and we've made so many friends. From now on, this lounge will be called Dream Short Hostelry. It's a place for all those who can't enjoy their sweet dreams. We are not accepted by the outside world, so forget it here. We are each other's sweet dreams. Looks like you're quite used to peering to people's hearts, right? I see ruling all my innermost feelings. <laughs> it feels pretty bad. It makes you feel vulnerable. Not a great skill at it. Well, we can't pick and choose right now. Let's keep going. I haven't finished my drink yet. I'm an orphan, and I never knew who my parents were. I was abandoned at a robbery hotel before I was old enough to remember anything. Raven, head of the Iris family, adopted me and raised me as a future star. I once achieved great success in my acting career, but in the end, the stage wasn't for me. I just couldn't fit in. Life under the spotlight was too much for me. I despised being in front of the camera, the never-ending interviews and the mind-numbering, boring scripts. I'd rather be with those monsters than in a rowdy crowd. I long for a real family. A real family like the Sweet Dreams too? Yep, you disassemble the innocent kids. Being with them brings me peace and happiness. That's why I can't stand those who treat them as tools and boss them around. Unfortunately, there are too many selfish and hypocritical, uh, hypocritical people in the dreamscape, pulling the weak to boost their own pathetic egos. So I left the stage because I wanted to help them. You know what happened next? The dreamscape started collapsing and the whole hotel got sealed by the family and became a spot infested by frenzied monsters. I stayed here, searching for the abandoned Sweet Dreams group members who were still sane. I established this lounge, making drinks for those monsters and finding ways to calm them down, hoping to change their fate. They are my most important family, and I don't want to see them get hurt. It's time to face reality. I'm so sorry, Shiyuban. We shouldn't have doubted you. You've done so much for us. I'm sorry, I haven't been spending much time at the launch lady and I haven't had a chance to explain a thing to you guys. The reason I this, entrusted this launch to Tamamo for now is that I had learned about the family's plan to eliminate all the monsters in the hotel in the, in the dreamscape. To stop them, I needed to regain the support of the Iris family. Mixing drinks, it's like having a conversation, but I couldn't do it well on my own. Look at you now, Shioban. What happened to that boldness you had when you confronted the entire Iris family? Remember when you came to me all excited saying, Hey, Emiki, I found a dog and it wants to come home with me. Now that you decided to run this lounge, take responsibility for it. Did I ever say I was running away, Emiki? You have become quite a lecturer, haven't you? I'm happy to see you grow more mature. Hey, don't try to change the subject. Let's go. We go meet our sounds. Two more? Don't get in our way. Whoever you are, don't think you can stop the Bloodhound family. Oh, you don't really don't care who we are? Being too reckless will get you in tr into trouble. Don't threaten me. A Bloodhound family member members will as resolute as steel. I don't mean to intimidate, but perhaps you could do the Iris assembly a favor? This Lady Emiki is the favorite daughter of Lady Maven, head of the Iris family, and she's now a superstar in the dreamscape. Are you willing to listen to what I have to say for her sake? Hey, you talk as if you're not a core member of the Iris family. Do you really see yourself as just a random Twinksmith? These monsters aren't aggressive at all, as you can see. 
A little scare is enough to frighten them. They won't pose a threat to the guest's safety. What's more, Tamawa's recent actions have proven that it can be controlled. This monster is actually more reasonable than you guys. <laughs> nice answer. Even the dream troll, dream troll troop, corrupted by the nightmare, can live in harmony with us. Those who are interested in those monsters and have visited the launch will tell you the same thing. If you don't believe me, why don't you ask around? And if you're truly interested, I can ask you our family had to speak with you guys. And I'm pretty sure her words will be more convincing than you think, don't you think? Uh, I'm a of the Starlet troop who came here with them. It feels terrible to treat it like life is object and boss around, doesn't it? Will you always have the choice to leave? Well, you always have the choice to leave. You don't have to spend your life obeying their orders. All your members are welcome at the Dream Trot hostelry. What's happening? The monsters are running away? Are they affected by the nightmare and going frenzied? Are we supposed to carry out this task without them? They didn't become frenzied, they simply just don't want to follow orders anymore. They've realized that they have options other than being mere tools for the family. Why is it here? Do you want me to say hi to your boss? No, of course not. We are leave right now. Sorry for the disturbance. Well, I choose to stay in the desolate hotel, in the dreamscape to stay away from family issues. But in the end, I had to rely on my family connections to protect this lounge. That's why your idealism counts of any problems. So stop being naive and be more realistic. Besides, you will fulfill what you promised me, right? Right? Don't worry. If I lie to you, we'll discuss the business once we've taken care of everything in the lounge. But she won't. Those guys were right. We'll be corrupted by the nightmare one day, right? Yeah, nothing will change. I can't help get rid of the nightmare completely. I'm sorry. Well, I feel like maybe we will successfully manage that. I didn't mean to blame you. Just like humans can get sick, members of the Sweet Dreams troop can be affected by negative emotions and become frenzied. Life is the process of constant change, and there is no permanent solution. Problems will always arise, and we will keep solving them moment by moment. <coughs> But no matter how much you all flip out here, I will stay here and help you find yourselves. In my eyes, you're not different from me. I stay with you forever until the dreamscape collapses completely. Thank you! And even if I'm gone one day, there's someone else who's willing to treat you all like family, right? Don't you agree in your drinks with? The dreamshot hostelry may have returned to its peace and quiet, but not all matters were resolved, such as... Shibam, this is not what we agreed on. You starting to talk like me now? We agreed that I would help you restore your relationship with the Iris family and keep this launch. In return, you promised me a comeback to the stage and per to perform together with me. But why are all the monsters' names listed on this promotional poster? A Steeler Spade, Melancholy Tremetist, Soda Bigwig. Lady Injustice, Steel Tin Man, and Starlet the Philosopher King. Your name isn't there. <laughs> Are you underestimating our performance skills, dear lady? Come to my show and you won't be disappointed. What you agreed was that the owner of the Dreamshot hostelry would assist the Iris family in their performances. Since this launch belongs to these monsters, they will be participating in the show. Is that a problem? I've even decided to become an idol to save our launch from closing down. You're being a sly. Huh. I've contacted the Platon family. They've agreed to, to postpone the cleanup of the hotel in the Dreamscape. In other words, the monsters will be safe, and the Dream Shell Dreamshot hostelry will continue to operate. Thank you for everything. If it weren't for you taking over as Dreamsmith, I wouldn't have time to deal with all the troubles with the family. Thank you. We really appreciate your help. Ah, oh, don't mention it. I knew you would say that. Whenever you feel like it, feel free to drop by. You're always welcome here. Alright, now go. Make yourself an exclusive drink as a souvenir of your Drinksmith career. 
And show me what you really like on the inside. Hmm, one for myself. Hmm. What I prefer the like would be... Shooting a soda, practitioner pepper. <laughs> the time I'm all. all right. Is the mixing down? Mm -hmm. This drink will be made specially for you. I read it to the Dream Shot Hustle drink menu. Customers will get to taste it, so you better consider your choice carefully. I'll pick this one. And this is really interesting. Oh, looks like Gallagher was right. It's always a surprise with you around. The special drink that belongs to you all will be kept on the Dream Shot Hustle drink menu to commemorate those who will forever be our friends. Always welcome, amazing drinks make drinksmith of Panacone. And with that, we've completed this event. Uh, toast have been resolved by the launch list to keep going. Okay. Uh, I don't really care because I've already got everything I can out of this event. So, yeah. Getting all these achievements. Wait, why is there still something new about the characters here? Tell me this is the end. Ah, oh, yeah, I got getting on. That's it. With countless marvelous sights to be seen, I couldn't possibly consider stopping here. Oh. There you go. I did actually put blade there. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, next I just have to do is Razors and get him a new red egg set. Good, with that one done, we still have like this Tides of War thing. <coughs> I hope it doesn't have so much text, because my voice is actually a bit eh, after so much writing. I think I would just skip this mostly. Uh, but maybe let's get to the point. Just cutting a to crew. I'm a technician from the Garden of Recollection. I'm a med uh, technician from the Garden of Recollection there. The arm is actually tight. Of war, unchanged childhood memories, passionate heart burning soul ultimate collection. It almost sounds like, sounds like a light novel title for a game. Uh, Tides of War gameplay details. Accumulate crit ready during the battle to elevate your crit phase. When in a crit phase power awoken, you can obtain powerful stage buffs. Like okay. Is it just a combat event? Uh, okay. Yeah, just a small combat event. Okay. Uh, if you don't come with crit value, okay, okay. Uh, increased damage received by enemies. Oh, no, boss enemies. Hmm. Uh. Uh, turn each shot that you feel increases uh, damage received by enemies. Um. Maybe it is a non boss target into a shutter and it flicks them with shutter. I don't have some of it if you don't Let's go for a dot party. You have a large amount of crit value. You need to defeat it with four capes. Okay. Six, uh, three bo wave bosses with six cycles. Just in time. Ill fate descends. 
still waters of oblivion. Cut in the net. Good times never last. Time to say bye. Boom. All right. I oh, you can use a current skill again. It tilts up far. Stand still. What do you want to know? Ill tidings manifest. Memories are beneath the waters, lies an endless abyss. May as well kill them all. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. I'll see you off. Oh. Relax. Destiny isn't chosen. Ill fate descend. Uh, okay, but was war in so an action? Okay. Okay, now can we do dragon attacks every time? Okay. Eternal sleep is not the end. The dead re Turn! Memories are beneath the waters, lies an endless abyss. I weep for the departed. It did not fall. Good times never last. Time to say bye. Boom. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Free will, or was it fake? Still waters of oblivion. May as well kill them all. I weep for the departed. Can we just spam like Ekron's ultimate here? What time do we have left? Oh, actually, quite a lot. Receive divinity. Don't worry, it's just Repay. a scream. What do you want to know? Good times. Never time to say bye. Boom. Ill tidings manifest. Another journey begins. Destiny for oblivion. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. The dead return! You chose the wrong enemy. Just need to actually get a lot of damage into your salmon. Uh. Nothing major. Glowing operations. Ill fate to say. Memories beneath the water lies an endless abyss. Free will, or was it fate? Still waters of oblivion. 
Annihilation. Receive divinity. Don't worry. It's just... It's just great. Good times. Never time to say bye. Boom. Eternal step. The dead return! I weep for the departed. It tends to fall. Memories are ever beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. <laughs> I reckon I can't sort of it. I weep go. for the departed. It tends to fall. I'll see you off. <laughs> Stand still. Destiny is apparent. Ill tidings manifest. Another journey begins. Destiny for oblivion. Say bye to breathing. Bye bye. Okay, where's next exit? Actually, got everything. Hmm. Okay, could my cannons could my uh, each time an ally's current HP is increased or decreased, accumulate crit value. Oh. Uh. As of turn consume a minor of which became blood rage, use like a flushing is crotating crit damage. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Mm -hmm. We want some follow-up attacks. Basic attack skills. I'm gonna take off my own Jingle Layu. Let's take Blade. Clara, maybe? Sure. Uh, Contribute with an action and with switch PFT. Get a face on uh, every time. Addition is take off now. Actually, uh, let's go with Fushuan. Actually, go with Fushuan. Just to mitigate more damage. is clouded. Converge and awaken. The redemption. <laughs> Stand down. <laughs> Try harder. A blade knows no mercy. Your end approaches. Bloom. Unnecessary. <laughs> I failed to send you. Eternal step. Dead return! <laughs> Tedious. Blade of moonlight. All will be revealed in the lunar flame. Paradise may be unsavor it for me. I'll see.
see you off. I haven't actually like already used played or anything yet, so I don't control what she's probably doing anymore, but Chose the wrong enemy. Bloom. Unnecessary. Repay. Eternal slip. The dead return. Did you have full turf floor? Just order it up. Entangled. Nowhere to run. <laughs> Failed to set you. All will be revealed in lunar flame. Already got back into level four. All will be revealed in the lunar flame. Eternal slip, the dead return. I'll see you off. <laughs> Equip divination. Failed to send you. Ready for death. Yang and Yang. Failed to send you. You're right, but. I was talking to me in this specific time. That paradise may be unreachable. Savor it for me. Receive divinity. Fail to send you. Eternal slip. The dead return. Stand down. Gather as one. The flesh wound. Tedious. Blade. All will be revealed. That's all out of those. In the lunar flame. <laughs> That paradise may be unsavor it for me. All things in this human creations. Eternal sleep and dead return. Blade fodder. I see through you. I will dispatch you. Your end approaches. 
Failed to send you. You chose the wrong enemy. Pledge thine loyalty. Too little. Put forth all your might. Yin and Yang. <coughs> Confess. Rise <laughs> to the challenge. Bloom. Save it for your own skin. Failed to send you. That paradise may be unresavor it for me. I don't have much more time actually to kill this. Give rise to the challenge. A blade knows no mercy. Receive divinity. Unnecessary. Repay. Eternal slip. The dead return. Rise to the challenge. Pledge thy loyalty. Fail to send you. Yeah. Uh, why did I not? Why was I not able to finish this? Uh, that sucks. That was also really close. I feel like I actually could have killed it, uh, killed him if he would have attacked. Jing the Yu, just so I could have got like her ultimate. <laughs> uh, sucks. Don't see if there's like actually an advantage to using them or not. Mm. Mm. Uh, I mean, I could see why Bronya works for this potentially. I had a. I actually don't really care about getting like the rewards for the third. Um, when I uh, when the ally positioned first in the group setup successfully uses the ultimate, you accumulate a large amount of crit value. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna use him first. Hmm. That's just a power to the name. It does do for your energy regenerations. Yeah, actually, not that stupid. Let's use that party setup. Awaken, dormant skip. 
World cleansing dragon. <laughs> Better late than never. Can you find the answer? Heaven's search. Break. Welcome, customers. Awaken, Dormant World cleansing dragon. <laughs> I have this is really focusing I would have Heaven search. Break. Cleansing dragon. <laughs> I'll go easy. Let's play hide and seek. Can you find the answer? A thousand wonders to rip <laughs> minus one. <laughs> Don't come any closer. <laughs> These are devils. I'll crush them all. Awaken the world cleansing dragon. <laughs> Sent a storm. Heaven search. Rise. Spray damage. <laughs> I'm scared. Stay put. Protect me. Protect me. Not fresh. Welcome, customers. <laughs> yeah. Not so fast. Feeling a little dizzy. The strength. Heaven search. Break. <laughs> Let's play for a while. Feeling spiffy? I'm gonna hold everyone's back! <laughs> Awaken the world cleansing dragon. Lights out! Let's... Can you find the answer? Ready? <laughs> A thousand wonders to <laughs> minus one. Awaken the world cleansing dragon. <laughs> Got them. I sense a storm. Heaven search. <laughs> Rise. Must be friends. <laughs> I'm not sure if I actually shall. I'll crush them all. Ah, uh, why is that also close? <sighs> I don't know like how stupidly close this is. But alright. Hmm. 
break enemy's weakness or attack weakness from minus three. Okay, right. Okay. Enemy is just use the amount of damage to reduce the toughness of enemies. Break enemy's weakness for display plus weakness protection. Okay, this are. Uh, Um. Raiders. Yeah. I don't need to take over for those. Blind? Why am I not seeing my characters? <laughs> yep. And what are the chemical skills again? Hmm. If I have damage, you could turn my cast on. Adjacent. Mm -hmm. Ah, she attacks with it. Yeah, okay. Mm. Let's remove you and get someone in who can heal. Hmm. its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Another journey begins. Some value, I suppose. Every petal all will be swept away by the wind. Don't humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Stay away. Free will, or was it fate? There's more to life. Eternal. Every petal all will be swept away by the wind. Oh, 
them all. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. You won't right. get away. Perhaps you still don't understand. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Every petal and all will be swept away by the wind. Yeah. That's half the work. Destined for oblivion. Give me strength! Much obliged. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. You won't get away. Grace and elegance. You won't get away. Also, I didn't pick Agor and though she's more for like a dot party. I just you uh, put her in for like her ultimate because it has weakness break, um, disregarding elements. Which is kind of nice. Another journey between the still waters of oblivion. Something for you. You'll show a beggar on. You won't get away. Perhaps you still don't. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Some value, I suppose. Eternal. I'm gonna hold everyone back again. Gotcha. All will be swept away by the wind. Time for an overhaul. Protect me, protect me. Oblige. Beings or devils, I'll crush them all. Ronnie has being a bit annoying. Enjoying yourself. Still waters. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. You won't get away. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Every petal and all will be swept away by the wind. Perhaps you still don't. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Beings or devils. I was also not be able to manage it, just barely. God, this is getting annoying. Existence is unity. Just for oblivion. Some value, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> Why are we just not barely able to manage these? God. It feels stupid. <sighs> I'm out of you whenever you defeat an enemy that deals off low damage. Okay. Increase all damage received and not the same. First damage of better damage. 
Okay. Oh, the, the damage that this attack deals will exceed the command they are defeated. Okay. That's all right. Our fortune is clouded. Converge and awaken. Time for a fun. <laughs> yes. Let's play for a while. Divination. <laughs> no matter. <laughs> All things human creations. Optimize. Hm. This is double speed. Huh. More enemies. Did that feel fit me? Let's play. Can you find the answer? I'll end your misery. I see through you. I'll free you from your disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Who's next? Can I have fun this time? Let's play for a while. <sighs> Don't, uh. Don't mess with me. Whoops. I'll end your misery. Oh, uh. This combat needs optimizing. <laughs> this is double speed. All things human creations. <laughs> Your chains disappear among the sea of butterflies, illusions of the past. Gather as one, huh? More enemies. Time for a fun. <laughs> Did that hurt? You spit me? Can you find the answer? What a headache. Your misery. Can I have fun this time? Time for a fun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just cutting them off one after another. Don't mess with me. I'll end your misery. From your chain, disappear among the sea of butterflies, illusions of the past. I'll end 
to misery. Huh. More enemies. I'll go easy this time. Feeling spiffy? I'll end your misery. Let's play hide and seek. Can you find the answer? This combat needs a. This no. is oh, wrong enemy. God. All things in this world have human creations. I'll free you from your chains. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. If I lose this because I just picked a wrong enemy with the even sea rough of hers. God. And awaken. I was all annoyed. I'll end your misery. What a headache. Who's next? I'll end your misery. I'll free you from your chain. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. Resistance is futile. No matter. Let's play for a while. Feeling spiffy? Don't mess with me. I'll end your misery. On my command. Take courage. What a headache. Can I have fun this time? It came together. Human creations. I'll go easy this time. Let's play. Can you find the answer? I think I won't be able to kill him again. Don't mess with me. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. No matter. Time for a fun. <laughs> this combat needs up to. This is double speed. Let's play for a while. I'll end your misery. Uh, come on, game. Fuck you. It's so sully. <sighs> okay. This will be the last one. Accumulate a large amount of crit value after Ls perform consecutive actions. Does this also come for follow-up attacks? Hmm. This will be advanced by 100% after ultimate cast, which gains crit value. Of course. Um, I may have my agenda build. 
Let's can take my agent here. I'm gonna take a venture ring. Let's do the uh, wait. I'm gonna use my own top as though. There you go. Hmm. Uh, you know what? I'm actually may use. I don't get Himmy Kosa, right? Hmm. I certainly don't get Himmy Kosa as an option, but I do want another person that can break Cocoria. If I remember correctly, Jingwen's being should count as follow up attacks. Uh, da, da, da. Yeah. Next attack and attack, this deck is automatic. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna take this and from consecutive actions. Alright. <laughs> Spin freely. Go nappy. Watch your head. The dice have been cast. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. All in. Wretched and clean. Beauty. I will protect all beauty. <laughs> Conflict is pitiless. <laughs> Time. Show no mercy. Uh -huh. Here is thunder. I come back, mayonnaise. Let the valuation begin. <laughs> Watch your head. The market is on right. Investing in victory means playing the long game. Okay. Sure. Work out nicely. Until Glad you hear that. I will protect all beauty. Wow, he can like really act a lot of one of another. Protect all beauty. Yeah. Okay. It's good to put up my uh my. Until I see that. Argenti. I will protect all beauty. I see now. <laughs> Here, this thunder. 
Until I see that light once more, I will protect all beauty. My oath is to escape. Beauty is eternal. Wretched and fleeting. Until I see that light once I will protect all beauty. He's getting to attack so much. World. Jesus. Beauty is eternal. Why do I just risk the entire time? Until I see that light once more. I will protect all beauty. Embrace okay. virtue. I think that's enough for now, Jandy. <laughs> no time to leave. <laughs> Hedge your bets. Spend freely. Huh. Easy, Numbi. <laughs> oh. It killed itself. Sweet. <laughs> Stop hitting yourself, sweet enemy. Ah. Liquidation. The market is unpredictable. Right. Investing in victory means playing the long game. Watch your head. Spam on Chenny attacks again. This is kind of stupid. My guiding beauty is it? But it's not really doing much damage against Concordia, sadly. He's just bringing up the crit radio really nicely. Conflict is pitiless. Watch your head. But I don't feel like I will actually be able to manage this one again. My guiding light. Wretched and fleet. Devoured by ice, the eternal breeze will bury you. Follow my charge. Here is thunder. <laughs> Show no mercy. <laughs> the dice have been cast. Uh, okay. Bust. 
Or maybe I'll take it off. Oh. The market is unpredictable. Right. Teddy, my Jenny is for you. This has been annoying. Show no mercy. But yeah, I'm not fair doing enough damage to Cordia, which is so stupid. Easy, Numbi. <laughs> Let the valuation. <laughs> It's pitiless. Here, it's thunder. A foregone conclusion. Uh -huh. Hedge your bets. Uh -huh. Until I, I will protect all beauty. <laughs> It's on me. My guiding luck. Beauty is eternal. Wretched and fleeting. Until I, I will protect all beauty. Beauty is eternal. I'm just not barely mentioning it again. Curry is not getting. Protect all beauty. It's not getting as much damage as I need to give her. Wretched and fleeting. Protect all beauty. Uh. <laughs> Easy, Numbi. Liquidation. <laughs> okay, Discord. The dice have been bust. Maybe just barely. Well, maybe I'll take it off. Oh. The market is unpredictable. Right. Investing in victory means playing the long game. <laughs> Show no mercy. Until I Okay, this was extremely lucky in the end. Beauty. <laughs> <laughs> All right. At least I get a second one on the ADS score. <laughs> And with that, we get all the necessary rewards I want. I'm not gonna grind all the others just for like this extra little bit of extra reward. Not worth it. Mm. How many points do I give him for the weekly counter? I'm actually not picked those up yet. I'll just save them for the next week because I will, uh, because otherwise I would like hit my weekly XP limit for the for the pass. Oh, that that event is also done. Mm. Make sure you get Himiko leveled up. I'll just give eventually in some loads as well. That's all. <laughs> Let's settle then. I'm going all in. Wait. Because I actually got wood. Because I'm gonna check. Oh, okay. Yeah, right. I can pick up this one. Um, I don't want to check one of my Genty. Let me check this relic. And I think I actually can because we got enough rewards. Yep. And the rest I can save for my blade. Sweet. Good. It's sad to say though, my own is, even though you just came back recently. I'm done with the event. And that was all my goal for today's stream. And I actually have to end the stream here because I'll actually have to take care of dinner and cooking it. <laughs> so yeah. Just in time actually, because in a time frame of like 6 p.m. to like 6 30 p.m. was somewhere like we're supposed to start with cooking, so fitting perfectly. So, with that being said, I don't have to I hope you enjoyed watching along. 
Uh, let's actually see who we can raid, if there's anyone online. Uh, mm, what is she playing? Ah, bottle escape for you. Mm. Sure. What if people actually follow us online so we can throw the raid over to them? They are playing Bottle Escape Raido. Uh, not Star Ray or anything like that. Just so you know. And yeah. Again, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed watching along. Be nice over there in the raid. Spread some love and some support. And with that being said, we will see each other again next time. Until then, bye bye.